Welcome back. Let's try playing this game Mahjong Nagomi, or Japanese Mahjong. For from you can get this through the Steam Store. It's not a sponsored thing. You can, it's a decent app. Other players do also use this. Uh, sorry, my chat window covers were in the lower left corner. It says copyright 2020 Zoo Corp as the publisher. So that said, uh, let's give this a go, shall we? So this is Mahjong, and I think we've already hit issue number one, is that um, my overlay is occluding stuff. So give me one second while we go fix that. This cat's got to get out of the way. Uh, the chat there actually, while it's mildly annoying, doesn't completely block what we're doing, and I don't have anywhere better to stick the chat window. Uh, so apologies for the inconvenience, but I think that's going to stay there. One thing I could do is slightly expand the dimension of this window to try to span the entirety of that black bar down there. Um, to span the complete width of the screen. This is as far as Windows will let me take the chat window. We'll just live with it. So, here we are. Uh, welcome to Japanese Mahjong, or Richi Mahjong. Uh, I've been told that the object of the game is to collect, uh, like Rami, to collect either three of a certain type of tile, or to collect runs. Like here we got, well, this is not two, three, four. Here we got a six. Here we got six, seven, eight is a run. Uh, here we have five, seven, nine, which is not a run. And I get to play first. Meld on. Sure, I guess so. Why not? Um, so I have to select a tile to discard, preferably one that's not already part of a run. Uh, I believe this is a three. I don't know the, all the numbers, so we're going to learn this as we go. Uh, I hear that one and nine tiles are hard to use. I hear that wind and dragon tiles can be powerful if other folks have collected them. In the upper left corner here, we see uh, some kind of tile which determines which other tiles score more points. This is some special tile that I don't recognize, although I assume this is like the one pin. And here we got a two pin, a six pin, eight pin, seven pin. Um, I think this is a wind tile. I think this is a dragon tile. And I think that's all we know. Um, I hear, I guess, winds and dragons are hard to collect. I don't really know. So let's chuck the dragon and just wing it. Oh, okay, so I could call Chi to collect this and assemble it in a set with some of my tiles. Let's do it. And just to demonstrate how it works, does that actually show up or is my chat window in the way? Okay, the chat window is a problem. We're going to have to dismiss the chat window. Sorry about that. So yeah, here we've taken... Whatever this symbol is, whatever these numbers are of man, and we've melted those together. Um, oh, actually, I have an idea where we could stick the chat window. It doesn't have to go at the bottom. So we can actually move this up. Uh, do, 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 like that. There we go. You can still chat and. I'll still show if things uh, people are talking. So, um, yeah, here there is a wind tile. Uh, I see, I think this is either a wind or a dragon. I don't really know. Um, I see there is a settings button. Perhaps the settings. No, wait, no, this has a settings menu, has a sub settings menu. Uh, the English language is fine. I guess I don't see an alternate piece set here. So we're just going to keep using this piece set. So there's a two pin, 
Okay, so yeah, this is the one pin, which means that two pins score double. We'll get into scoring at the end of a round. So from the wall, wherever the wall is, I don't know, there's some deck of tiles called the wall. Each turn you draw a tile. Here we drew a seven pin. We've already got a seven pin and an eight pin and a four pin and a two pin. So if we were so lucky as to draw the three, that'd be fantastic. I don't think we're going to be so lucky as to draw that three. So the question becomes, well, I mean, is the seven better or worse in terms of being able to get triples or runs than a two or a six? Uh, well, six, seven, eight is the run. We don't need another seven, but potentially, I don't know, potentially we draw all four sevens or something. That seems crazy, right? Um, this is a 5, this is a 7, this is a 9. Let's chuck the 9 and see where people are at with that. Alright, so we now drew a 2-man, so I think that gives us 2, 3, whatever these other numbers are. Um, I don't think that's 4. I think 4 is a square, but I could be wrong. Um... So here we've got some pins. We got a five and a seven. If we were so fortunate as to draw the tile between them, then we'd have a run there. But here we see somebody's already discarded a seven. We've discarded a nine. Um, this person discarded a two. So um. Yeah, see, this person's discarded some man tiles. There is a man tile. I have not discarded many men yet. And maybe it would be to my favor to do such a discard, since I don't know what these numbers are. Um, although here, this is kind of a guide, isn't it? So, I think that's... I think that's 7. The upside-down 7, I think, is a 7. So I guess this would be 8, and I guess this would be 6. So this might be 6, 7, 8. If that's 6, 7, 8, then this is an 8. If that's an 8 and this is a 2, 2 and 8 are not the same number. I'm have, uh, This is a 1. This, I don't know. Um, so perhaps... Oh, wait, isn't this the 7? Yeah, so maybe that's 7, 8, 9. I don't know. Regardless, this is a big number. This is a little number. This is a little number. I don't know if these are adjacent or not. Um, it would help if I knew my Japanese digits, wouldn't it? Maybe that would be a cheat sheet that would be worth keeping in the chat window if nowhere else. Um, but yeah, since... Let's discard the pins, since I only have two pins, and I've got lots of men. I'm sorry, let's discard... what's this? Bamboo. Let's discard bamboo, and just keep chucking bamboo. Um, somebody already tossed a seven bamboo, so let's toss another seven bamboo. Chi. Okay, that's a three. Wait. What do you mean chi here? Is that to say two, three, four is possible? But I didn't think this is a four. Well, game, show us what this is. Uh, what? Three, two, four. Okay. Cool. So now we still have a three, we still have this. Um, now somebody discarded a two bamboo. If they chucked a two, they're... it's likely that they might have a three or a... F well, if they chucked a two, they probably don't have a three. Um, they might have a four, they might have a six. If they have a four or a six, then they don't need a five. Unless, well... Yeah, there's some rule about octaves. I don't know it, but I think whatever it is justifies chucking this bamboo. Uh, here we got a wind or dragon tile. 
Um, these score points, but I don't know how to use them. So let's just chuck it. Richie. So Richie means this person does not need to draw any more tiles. Uh, or uh, whenever they draw tiles from the deck, from the wall, that they are going to uh, just always chuck out the tile that they draw. Um, until... Sorry, my brain kind of went here. Um, oh, they chucked a four. Maybe I should chuck my four in solidarity. Um, but yeah, they're in a position where they can keep throwing away tiles uh, that they draw from the wall or the deck until uh, they get the one tile they need to complete the game. So I want to be careful not to give them the one tile they need. So I chuck out something they've already checked out. Uh, okay. I'm not pleased about this situation. They've already chucked a four. I'm guessing if they threw away a four, they're also going to throw away a seven. So this is a dragon tile, five bamboo, a wind tile, seven bamboo. And they've not drawn any of the other tiles that any of us have discarded, so... Generally, I'm safe to discard something that matches an existing discard. Um, problem is, I don't think I have anything like that. Because I was over-aggressive in discarding such things earlier. So that puts us in a really tight spot. Um, the next rule of thumb would be to discard toward the edges the 1s and the 9s. I've already followed that principle, so I don't have any 1s or 9s. Again, perhaps I was much too aggressive following that, so now we have to take chances and discard things they might have. Alright, so I was lucky. This is not something they're collecting. This is something I've already discarded, so I can continue discarding the same thing. Um, I'm wagering that since they keep chucking bamboo, that's not what they're collecting, plus I've repeatedly discarded bamboo and have no need for it. Long. Well, damn. I gave them the one tile they needed. So, I have to pay up. These are the terms under which my payment is regulated. So, they scored double points on this, double points on this and this. Since this is a five, and since these... The one tile up here in the wall was a one bamboo. Um, so these each score extra for two bamboo. Plus, yeah, they... So I owe them whatever this total is. Is my chat window blocking that? Actually, no, it's not. Perfect. So, yeah, that's round one. I pay up heavily for giving them the tile they needed. Nobody else has to pay, because that's my mistake. Alright, round two. Fight! Um... Interesting. So, which tiles have the least potential for me here? I'm guessing the men tiles? Are the ones that... Oh, I have a one... No, the one is not great. Let's chuck it. Okay, we got a two pin that would fit between our one and three pins. Um, let's chuck the other man tile. And here we got some bamboo. Got a one, a two, and a four. A six, a seven, a nine. So, I don't think the nine's useful, but also I've got... What are these? So this is a dragon. This... I don't know. I don't know if that's a wind or a dragon. This is a white dragon. This is... I don't know. But if I see something that's been repeatedly discarded, I'm not going to be able to make use of the same thing. So let's chuck this. 
Um, I think this is a west wind. Uh, looks like a W there. I don't know. But, oh, so five pin is shown up here. So therefore, six pin scores more this round than it would in most rounds. We got one, two, three already. We've got three, three. Um, I don't see myself collecting dragons at the moment. So let's chuck it before it become hurts us too much to hold on to it. Uh, likewise, I don't see myself collecting wind tiles. Okay, we've drawn a two and a whatever the heck this is. Uh, somebody's already discarded a two, so our odds of drawing multiple twos are lessened. Okay, chi would mean I get to draw this. Yeah, this is actually useful to take. Chi. So I drew, I've got one, two, three, but I still have my two, three set here, so that's pretty cool. Uh, let's check this. Okay, <laughs> that's spooky. They're one away. Um, This has already been discarded by another two other players, so I don't think this could be collected at this point. Uh, Chi would allow me to draw? Yeah, why not? Chi. So I'm one step closer to going out. Uh, the problem here is I need to discard something they're not collecting. I see here they've tossed out some bamboo already. A three and a six? Eight? I don't know. Some number. I don't know if that's a six or... No, that's an eight. Um... In general, ones and nines don't get collected much, but what do I know? So here I got six, seven, nine, and one, two, four. So my odds of going out are not great. They've already tossed a one, but they might have other sets. So let me just toss the nine and think harder next turn. Oh, great. One, two, three. Perfect. Um, the problem is, again, here we're in this discard situation. Uh, I don't know. This is pretty rough. So let's chuck the one. Okay, that's a nine. I don't have any use for a nine, and they've already discarded a nine. Oh, okay. Uh, that's a five. So we've got four, five, six. Um, well, that's interesting. What's this? F what? Four, seven. And here, if I go over this, it says two. I don't understand. Some of these give me advice, and some of these don't give me advice, and I don't know why. What the hell? 4-7, what does this mean? What could that possibly refer to? Um... Hmm. I don't know. Well, damn. I gave them exactly the tile they needed. And they score bonus points, etc. So maybe doing this chi thing... Oh, they drew from the wall what they needed. They didn't get it from me. Okay, so yeah, I still had to pay up. But that wasn't my fault. That's just how the deck rolls. Alright. Well, I can see this was already chucked once. Uh, oh, that's kind of cool. So, here we got a 4 and an 8. Uh, let's chuck the 4, just for fun. And then the 8. Chi. Oh, 1, 2, 3, let's do it. Oh, what? Oh, I could do 1, 2, 3, or 2, 3, 4. Chi. So we're going to do 1, 2, 3, Chi. Um, and then, I don't know, what have people discarded so far? 
the odds of getting a three is not super great. Uh, probably the uh, white dragon's already been discarded. So my odds of drawing another white dragon are lessened as compared to drawing other things. Uh, but I've got two white dragons already. I've got one of this. And I don't see other of that being having been discarded yet. Um, so we're going to toss that in what might be a stupid play, but I just don't know. Likewise, we're going to toss that. All right. We've drawn a one, but one seems pretty useless. Yes, because that's a nine, the one scores more. But um, I guess also that means I've already played a one, and I don't have another two here, so like this one's kind of useless for me. Um, this is a lot of bamboo. I think this is an eight. Um, so I don't have a seven or anything close to it. Bichi. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is Richi Mahjong. Um, well, I don't know, man. What are they? Cl oh, they chucked a four, so let's chuck a four. All right. Um, or they discarded a four, so let's discard a four. Let's discard a one, because discarding ones tends to be safe. Ditto. Pawn. Oh, cool. Yeah, this allows me to go out of turn and snatch that. Huh. Kaboom. That's dangerous, though, because now I have to discard again. Um, and I don't know what to discard. Uh, they already discarded a two, so let's discard a two. I've already discarded one of these, let's discard another. Long. Oh, not my fault. Alright. So, San, something was mentioned, so three double. I don't know. So, we still have to pay up there? Or rather, okay, this person gave them the tile they needed. I'm still in fourth. What can you do? Such is life. Um, I mean, there is some strategy to this game, or so I hear. Alright, so we've got no... It would still help to know what the tiles are, wouldn't it? Uh, so this has been discarded. Let's discard the same thing. <laughs> Look at that, the middle finger, another middle finger. Middle fingers all the way around. Sure. I don't know. Um, two. Alright, so if I don't toss this early, I have to toss it later. So let's get rid of it early. Um, this is a nine. I forget what this number is. It would help to know your digits. I think this is seven, and that's nine, this is four. So I don't think I'm gonna be able to make use of the four. Okay, well that's kinda cool. We got something going here. Um, have people been discarding these dragon tiles? If not, let's try to get some dragon tiles. Oh my goodness. Wow, we got something running here. I don't even know what this is, but we got something. Alright, we'll chuck the 9. Oh shit. Should have done the 7, not the 9. My bad. Alright, have they tossed this tile? No. Unless that's the same as this, but I don't think so. Um. Hmm. Well, we're still playing risky. So. Green dragon can go. 
G. Oh, two, three, four. Um, do I want the two? Yeah, why not? The problem with taking that is then I have to figure out what to discard, but I've got a nine man to discard. T. So let's check the nine. Uh, wait, <laughs> that's not a nine because that's a nine. Okay. Um, now what is this? Four bamboo, seven bamboo. And that's what I get when I mouse over the nine. Uh, here we see a... that's also a nine? But I just don't know what the four and the seven have to do with the nine. Pawn. Oh, nice. Huh. Um... Seven, seven, eight. Three, four. Have they discarded a three or a four? No. Going out of turn like that was pretty risky. But puts me one step closer to going out myself. Um... I still don't know what the, these numbers are. Is that a 10? Or is that a 0 or something? I don't know. I thought these only go 1 through 9, so whatever this is is pretty cool, but... Um, here we got a 5, 5, and a 6, and a 4, and a 3. Oh, they've discarded a 2, which means they might have 4 or 5, and if they've got 4 or 5, then they... Oh, if they've discarded a 2, if they had 3, 4, they would not have discarded the 2. Therefore, they don't have 3, 4, so I might be okay to discard a 5. That's the theory of octaves. Yeah. Took me a second there. Um. Well, shit. This is the problem, though. Because I, well, I've got to take some risks if I want to win this, but I don't see anybody having discarded a six pin. Oh, there's a six pin. It was six turns ago. Yeah, there's, this is pretty risky, but whatever. Nine. Ain't nobody collecting nines. This... This was discarded four turns ago by that opponent. Chi. Oh, two, three, four. All right. Uh, apparently, I don't have something that's valid to go out. Okay. <laughs> I don't know, man. Green Dragon. Strong game. Alright, next. Woo! I profited that round because I actually melted something. East, round four. All right, so I set this to uh, set this to back to the default. I originally had considered setting this to be four rounds instead of eight, but no, nope, we're doing the full eight rounds. Welcome. I'm doing mahjong for the first time ever, and I'm down like twenty thousand points or something. Um, so am I doing it right? You be the judge. I still don't know what all the numbers and symbols are. It's an extremely hot mess. Um, so, uh, I don't have multiple wind tiles, so I don't know if chucking a wind tile makes sense. We got one, three, and then whatever this number is. And you'd think from Shogi that I would know what some of these are, but, eh, it's just my understanding. Um, yeah, let's toss this. Why not? There's a one. Oh, pawn. 
Sweet! Triple dragon. I think that's a green dragon. So one was discarded, so let me discard a one. Uh, sure. Two, three, four. Um... Oh, this dragon was discarded, so let's toss it. I gotta leave him guessing. Three, four, seven, nine. Um. <laughs> oh, I was waiting for a tile to win, so that's what's called Tenpai. Oh, nice. Thanks for the clarification. Um. Alright, yeah, shit, I don't know what to do here. Um, I don't think these numbers are adjacent, so I'm just going to check the three. Alright, two, three, four. Um, <laughs> Pump. I don't know. Oh, poo. That's why you don't toss these tiles. Oh my goodness. No. Well, thanks, whoever's playing in that position. West player wins. Well played, South. You just gave the West player the game. Alright, whatever. <laughs> I still need a pair to win. Okay. In general, I don't know if Chi is risky or not. It solves some problems and creates other problems. And, yeah, I just don't know strategically if that's good or bad. Alright, so we drew a 2 bamboo. We got a 1-1, one, 2-2, one, two, two, and all this other stuff. This... What the hell is that? Oh, I'm sorry, this is a 5 here. That's why it's red. This is a 9, so that must be an 8. This weird thing that kind of looks like, to me it looks like a frog. Must be an 8 bamboo. Um, so. Let's see, where do we start? We've only got two of these. Or we've only got this pin. We don't have any other pins, so let's chuck this pin first. Um... We're going to learn our numbers the hard way here, folks. So, yeah, we've got a 9, a 3, a 5, and then whatever these numbers are, there's something between a 5 and a 9. And we drew another one of that. So, I think that's a 6. So, 5, 6, 8? I don't know. We're going to learn the numbers here, folks. Um, so I know this is glowing and all, but it's not next to six. It's a nine, so we toss that. This is a four, I believe, so we have three, four, five. Oh, we are close to having a hidden sumo. Two, three, four, five... Six, eight, eight, nine. One, one, two, two, four, six. One, one, two, two, four, six. Well, uh, has anybody? I've already discarded a nine. I could discard a six. That's not safe, but and other players will see. Hey, this guy's tossing out all the bamboo tiles. Um. But realistically, the, trying to aim for a 5 bamboo seems pretty selective here, so... We'll try to open our options a bit. Dragons haven't been discarded yet, so... It's not unreasonable to imagine I might get a 3. Um, but yeah, with this 889... I don't know. No, a three is... Uh, I don't know what to do. Has anybody discarded a one or a two? No. Everybody's hoarding bamboo, except this guy. This guy let uh, one of those go already. 
I'm not likely to collect all the dragons because this is my first one. I'll discard it early before it gets too difficult to figure out what to do about it. And discard pins because we don't need pins. Pawn. Okay, what is this? Oh, that's a one. Sure. We'll pawn the one. Now we need a two or a three. Um, still we have this dilemma. Probably it's best to toss the nine. So we have two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine. Oh no, trying to get a three. I don't know. Getting a two or a three would help me out here. I want to keep that option open. Nobody's discarded a three or a two yet. I'm going to discard on the edges. Um, so we got two, three, four, five, six. If we had a seven, that would be fantastic for multiple reasons. But wait, since since we don't have a seven, um, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I mean, probably discarding the nine at this point makes sense. Because if I draw a 7, it's useful in multiple other ways. And yeah, I think that's... Oh, there's no way for me to get a valid hand. Oh, sorry. Um, alright. Lesson learned. So, yeah, it helps to know what you're doing, even marginally. Uh, so I have no way... I have 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 of man, or character. Yeah, and then the 8. But you mentioned because I did the pawn and I wasn't reading the chat carefully enough. So I'm waiting for 147. Um, now here, I could hit the back button. I should slow down a bit because I didn't recognize you were super familiar with this. Sorry, I should have been reading more carefully. Uh, I have a dead hand anyway, as you put it. So, um, but no, I think the thing to do at this point would be that. That I want to G this so I could get these three. Um, and I could toss this. Yeah, other G. players here are bots. Alright. I don't know what any of the valid hands are, so we're learning this the hard way. But, um... <laughs> yeah, we'll call this the practice round. Congrats. I, I've heard the word Yaku. I know it refers to some kind of condition that allows you to win the round. I don't know what any of the Yaku are, although I've been repeatedly taught what they are, but I've repeatedly forgotten. Such is my memory. Um, See, so yeah, I actually don't know what any of the Yaku are, so that impairs my chances of winning just a touch. Um. But I'm starting to get the sense that these dragons and winds matter more than I thought. And I shouldn't just tuck them all out. Although here, they did just toss out this, so I should toss the same thing. But... Um, three west wind. Here. Yeah, I don't know. I guess I could read the rules. Wouldn't that help? <laughs> I think that would help. Um... Hmm, I don't know. Hmm. So we got a 3, a 6, and a 9, and another 9. Which is a fantastic hand, I guess. Not really. Maybe a run of 4 would be considered... No, I don't know. I'm just speculating what might be valid and what might not be valid. 
Ähm. But I guess if I'm drawing into dead hands, that's not so great. So I guess the moral of the story is don't always hit the chi button. Yeah, in Richie Mahjong, you always need to have at least one Yaku in order to win. You can't just meld everything and expect to win. Uh, having, having not melded anything and still successfully completed the round is a win condition. Maybe that's the condition I should be going for every time, is just never Chi. But once I've done my first Chi, then I don't know. So let's see, what does this look like? There are multiple... Oh. What? Excuse me? Oh, 5, 6. That's a 7 over there. So I could do 5, 6, 7. Or 6, 7, 8. Or 7, 8, 9. Well, we're going to do 7, 8, 9 because that lets me ditch the 9 tile. T. Um, But this might be stupid in retrospect because i still need some way i need a yaku and i don't know what any of the yaku are three easy yaku to learn okay um do, do, do. i mean i've already lost this particular set of eight rounds because I'm trailing 10,600 to ridiculous point values, but I can still read what you're chatting while accepting my fate here. Um, so we had 5, 6, 7 potentially. Here we got 6, 7, 9, and another 9. Has anybody discarded a 9? No. Um, so annoyingly, that leaves me with a dilemma. Has anyone discarded a three over this? Nope. Oh, I'm sorry. Three, three, five, and then anything. I should discard this. This way, a three or a four would be acceptable. So I got five, six, seven, nine. Um. So. One pawn of dragons, or the seat wind, or the rounds wind. Okay. All simple tiles. No dragons, no winds, no ones or nines. Oh, so I just melded a nine. But, okay. Point taken. Um... All pawn. Oh, all right, cool. All right, well, let's check this. So five, six, there's a six there. Five, six, seven, nine. Uh, whatever, let's do it. Neat. Pawn. Sure, why not? Sacred discard. Okay. Dude, I invoke the sacred discard. I guess that's cool. Maybe. Maybe not. Um. I guess that means I, I discarded something that couldn't be taken? I don't know. Or rather, that other people's discards are immune to my capture. That might be what's going on there. Alright, let's try to collect whatever this is. No. Oh, they went out. Dichi. Dora. Liangham. Oh yeah, the special seven pair hand. Now, you mentioned all pawn. I actually don't remember what pawn is. Um, 
certainly have done chi a number of times. I've seen pawn done once or twice. And I think I might cut out doing chi every single time, because it's there's it's apparently it's tactical rather than strategic. Oh, we got two, three, four, three, four, four, seven, nine, three, nine, and then this. Um <laughs> so this dragon was already discarded. My odds of drawing uh, enough of this dragon are not great. So let's toss it. Two. A oh, pawn is three of a kind. Okay, cool. Um, so yeah, here I could be aiming for either all simple tiles or a dragon or a wind seat. And eventually I'll figure out which... I assume this is a north wind and not a dragon, but I don't know. Uh, whatever this rightmost thing is. So, on the left I got 2, 3, 4, simple. I could chi 2, 3, 4. Oh, that's south. Okay, so this is south round 3. Nice. Okay. So that would be a very good thing to keep, assuming I can get it. Um, because, yeah, that would cover my Yaku. Playing all simple tiles would cover it. All pawn would do that, but that's all pawn seems really difficult to do. Um, yeah. So all south tiles. Oh, that's interesting, too, now that I think more about it. Since I have two south wins, that means other players, each individually, could not have three south wins, because I already have two of them. Meaning, if I just hold on to these two, eventually either other players are stubbornly holding on to theirs, or I will get one. So that's why you say easy, Yaku, because other people can't get it if I stubbornly hold on to mine. Now, they could just as easily hold on to theirs, but yeah. That seems... Let's try it. Let's aim for this as the Yaku. So... I'm gonna chi that. And then... Let's see. We got it. 2, 3, 4 over there is fantastic. 4, 7, 9 is less fantastic. 3, 5, 6 is not terrible. Um, 4, 7, 9 is not fantastic at all. So... Uh, do I cut the 4, the 7, or the 9? I would think the 4. But... Uh, it's harder to get... If I hold on to 7, 9, I'm banking on getting the 8. Whereas if I hold on to the 4 or the 7, I might get other things in between. Oh, yeah. Keep the two 4s, a circle, as the pair. Oh, interesting. Yeah, I guess pair collection is strategic in this game. Um... Okay, so I think that's a west wind, right? Um, oh, I'm in the west seat. <laughs> but somebody's already discarded one, so this would not be an easy thing to collect. Uh, on the other hand, I'm not doing super great on collecting, like, pins. So... Um, I could... Well, also, this is not... I'm aiming for, I guess, either a 4. Uh, I mean, the 4 is already covered here. Um, yeah, so I don't need this 3. A 4 or a 7 bamboo would be useful. Here we got a pair of 2. We also got a 4 and a 7 there. The 4 and the 7 both still not useful. Um... Aim for 3 south, 2, 3, 4 of character, 7, 8, 9 a circle, 4, 5, 6, or 5, 6, 7 a bamboo, 
in a pair of four or a circle. Let me reread that. So for south round three, aims are two, three, four of character. Yeah, we got that. Seven, eight, nine of circle. Uh, yeah, the circle or pin. Yep. Uh, four, five, six, or five, six, seven of bamboo. Yes. Oh, I just threw the nine of circle. Um. So I did. Um. Yes. Yeah, sorry, I am being like this is my first exposure to the game. I'm whatever I'm doing is both hasty and tense. Um. Having a pair of two character is not going to help me here. Unless I got... Well, no, we don't have all pawn, because we already did a sequence 2, 3, 4, circle. Uh, yeah, I cheat my second 2... Yeah, you're right. Oh! Oh, shit. Yeah, I didn't think about that. That's interesting. So yeah, that I've put myself in more of a bind that I recognize, because I'm like, I'll just wait for another four and another four to come out, but that's unlikely. So I put myself in a bind. Uh, I think this is my best chance to get out of it. Sorry if I'm playing much too hastily and playing a lot of stupid moves here. Um... Okay, what? So that's a five. Oh, so this must be a six. So we got two, two, three, four, five, six. So we could get um keep the West as a safe discard. Okay, we can hold on to it then. If I'm holding on to it, then I probably shouldn't chi here. Um unless like right now I chi and then I discard a uh, bamboo. Oh, that's a seven. That's a what? Okay. Um, hmm. These numbers are tricky for me to read. But no, if I'm reading this right, this is two, two, three, four. I thought that was a 5. I thought this was a 6. This is telling me Chi, so I'm eligible to take that. Chi for 3, 4, 5, and throw the 7. Oh, I'm sorry. Yes. Okay, 3, 4, 5. That's how I'm eligible to take it, not 4, 5, 7. Yeah, okay, so the one that looks like an up down, upside down 7 is a 7. Yes, yeah, so let's Chi that. Chi! Which, now I have no hope of collecting a trio of sevens or something like that, or a run leading to it, so we discard that. We're keeping the West Wind as a safe discard tile, because only we could go out with the West Wind. Um, the one here is not useful, so I'm going to discard the one. That looks like a five to me. Um, so if I'm reading this right, five character, two, two character, then we got five, six bamboo and all the winds. We're going to keep holding winds. The five character is not of any use to me, and I don't know that's of use to other folks. So I think discarding the five character is probably the most reasonable course while I wait for another two character. Um... So, nobody's called Ricci yet. We can still safely do that. Um, six. Yeah, again, I'm not collecting circles. Okay, now they've called Ricci. So around here, I've got to be thinking about safe discards. That looks like an eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This is an eight. They're not collecting eights. We'll bet the game on it. Uh, my aim is a two Han hand with three South and one Dora. 
Okay. Yeah, so I see here the five is the Dora. You've got um, two south, one west. And uh, yeah, we're still aiming for two Han, a two character, I think. Um, so yeah, they've already discarded an eight. You discard an eight. <sighs> this is where things get risky. Um, so they're to our immediate right. Uh, they've discarded a two and a four. It's unlike, well, I mean, maybe they just happen to have two twos and two fours or something stupid like that. Um, in my mind, it's unlikely that they're collecting that particular, or that they need the three circle. Yeah. If it becomes risky, then we throw the safe tile. Right. Okay. Well, I think this qualifies as risky. Further, I don't think I'm getting the west... I would have to, from the wall, draw another west wind. If I got one more west wind from the wall, um, then other players could not discard their west wind safely. I see one's already been discarded. I don't see another west having been discarded yet. Um, so I don't think it's risky enough yet. I think I still need either a south wind or a west wind would be excellent for me here. I think discarding the three, although it's somewhat risky, gives me the best chances of going out. But I don't think it's that risky. So I'm just going to play it. 25 remain. All right, so they've discarded a 2 and a 5. Here I am holding a 7. So if they had 5, 6, 7, they would not have discarded a 5. Uh, so they're not holding 6, 7. If they're not holding 6, 7, they're not holding a 7. Or they're not holding a 6. But, like, I don't want to discard the 7 here. So this is the point where it's too risky. Oh, really? Okay. Because the 4... Oh, right! They've already discarded the 4. So if they had 4, 5, 6... Okay, that's a good point. Yeah, I'm on board with that. I still need a West Wind. If I could get a West, I would be so happy here. All right, so a 6. So we got 5, 6. Oh, we got 5, 6, 6. Ugh. But we need the Dora. We need that glowing 5 tile. Um, otherwise, I can't go out. So the 6 is not of use to me, but other people might use the 6. This is... I think this is the point where I have to discard the West Wind. Um, yes, you're right. Um, so I think this is the point where I do discard the West Wind. Uh, and other players will do the same thing momentarily, because I think what this means is that multiple players each have a West Wind tile, or that one player is harboring them. <laughs> but actually, yeah. If one player was holding multiple West Winds, they would have started discarding them already, knowing that I can't possibly have collected them all. Uh, they're, or, unless they're trying to get the West Winds for some reason, but they don't have any reason. Uh, yeah, if it becomes much too... Well, the deal here is we're in South Round 3, and I'm down a bajillion points, and I don't mind losing the game. So, yeah, I think at this point I do toss the West Wind. I'm still trying to win the round. I don't mind taking crazy, stupid risks at this point, because we're just memeing. All right, what the hell do I do now? <laughs> we got three south. So three south is the Yaku we need. We still don't have two man. 
Um, I really puzzled what to do. Obviously, I'm keeping the south, unless... Well, no. Like I said, I'm playing stupid, risky moves at this point. So I'm committing to keeping all the south, because that could help me um, win the round. So, that said, if I'm picking one of the first five tiles to discard, which of these do I discard? I assume it's character two. Unless character two is way too risky and I have to discard something else, but I think uh, character two is the right discard here. Uh, yeah, if I were playing defensively, if I were in first place, I would just throw the soft tiles without thinking. But yeah, since I'm desperately far behind, um, and I don't mind completely busting, so my risk tolerance is I am keeping the south winds just for fun. Because that's the content play here. Um, I think discarding the character two is of the stupidly risky plays the least stupidly risky play out there. Now wait, somebody has the south wind. I've got three of them. Somebody's got the other one. They're not going to give me it. Yeah, never mind. Um, okay. So throw a bamboo six. Yeah, actually, that makes sense, because I could use either a four or a seven bamboo. Plus, they've already discarded a nine. So they're at that point, they were not holding seven, eight, nine. Or if they were holding seven, eight, nine, they were also holding six, seven, eight, nine. So six is... Six is fine. Run. Okay. Wait a second. Wait a freaking second. Uh, oh, that's a four. I thought that was a six. So what that would be would be four, five, six. I've got Yaku and a pair. So Ron wins the round, right? Yeah, I win. So we just run that. No. Boom. Fun fight. Now, yeah. stupid question. <laughs> I win the round, of course. And these are the rules under which, and I don't get a lot of bonuses, because, you know, I just barely won it. That's fine. Other people have scored lots of points in other rounds. Um, that didn't say sumo. It said wrong. I think is sumo, like, I've just melded my entire hand all at once and didn't have to take any tiles to do it. Whereas Ron... I'm sorry, no, Ron is I'm taking your tile and I'm going out. Sumo is I just got something from the wall and I'm going out. Yeah. Sumo is when I draw the winning tile. Okay, cool. Thank you. Woo! Still last place. Totally not worth that strategy. Oh, I'm sorry, not last place actually. Okay, the whole time I was complaining here, East is actually losing, but it's fine. Uh, it's still fun to play it that way. Run, yes, when you went on discard. That's right. Cool. And if I've messed up my overlay, I think everything's visible. But if I've messed up the overlay in some significant way, let me know. I'll fix it. Hey, look, triple eight. That's pretty cool. So since we've got triple eight, well, okay. The character tiles of no use to me. Um. Hmm. All right, south round four, and we got a south wind, and we got whatever the hell this is, and we got a dragon. Is this a wind? That looks like a chair, an incense, a lance from Shogi. So, an incense would be a wind. Uh. So, like, I have no use for that wind in terms of being able to go out with it. I have east and south. Okay. Uh, so east theoretically could use that. Uh, unless I discard it right away. 
I have no use for an east wind, but east would have a use for an east wind. So do I hold on to that as a safe discard, assuming that two players have no use for it? Or do I discard it right away because I have no use for it? Um, I don't know. Also, like... No, the dragon I definitely should keep. Uh, if I'm choosing between tossing a wind or a dragon, I think it would make more sense to keep the dragon since I could use it. Keep safe discards. Okay. Oh yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, I'm always filled with uncertainty late in the game. So we'll keep safe discards. So I see here we've got... Oh, this was not a... I don't remember if this is a bamboo or a circle. No, if it were a circle, it would be to the left there. This is bamboo, bamboo, two bamboo. This character is something I have no use for. Um. Oh, I'm sorry, I misread your statements. At the beginning, keeping safe discards is not of use, because you at the beginning, you really care about maximizing your winning chances um, as opposed to minimizing your losing chances that makes sense can get on board with that um i think the character is the least useful among everything here but now i look at the board and see all this crap people have discarded one dude already chucked a south wind. Uh, that's sad. I mean, it's going to be harder for me to get that. Three hidden, three of a kind. Oh, yeah, that could be fun. Because I'm halfway there. Yeah. Now, you mentioned three hidden, three of a kind. Um, It wouldn't be hidden if I did pawn. Um, but three of a kind is something I should be grateful for. I don't, don't pawn. All right. There's always going to be one more of those that comes out, so we don't need to pawn right now. Um, so two looks pretty useless to me. We've got six, eight, eight, eight. Um, two doesn't combine with anything. I can't really tell what other people are collecting, because they keep tossing all these other... Well, this is a character. They keep tossing winds and dragons, so I don't really know what they're trying to collect. Um, we got one, 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 two... Well, we're not going to break up the triple one. That would be stupid. So I think tossing the two makes the most sense here. Um... Throw the white dragon and keep the south as a safe tile. Okay. Yeah, I'm not close to collecting white dragons, so we can can discard that. So we get 2-3, which is great. We'll, we're quite happy about that. I think... Uh, oh, somebody's already discarded a 2 bamboo. So it would not be unreasonable. And there's a 3... It would not be unreasonable for me to discard a 2 bamboo at this point. That's my guess. Um, so, I could give it a shot. Yeah, let's, let's discard the 2 bamboo. Okay. Oh, wow! <laughs> uh... Oh, you'd throw the 5 instead of the 2. Okay. Um, you might be right. Oh, because... Okay, yeah. I guess my logic's backward. No call. I want to go for Ricci here. Interesting. Okay. Uh, man, I see a button, I push a button. But, yeah, I think that makes sense. So now we got two, three, four, so I think six... Well, I should discard this... 
either this six or this five. I don't know. Um, I guess I should bias toward the five. Yeah, the five bamboo. That makes sense. Um, so again, you mentioned three hidden pairs would be a yoku. I don't have a yoku if I take that. Um, yeah, six, oh, it does have some potential to melt with an eight. Yeah, somebody could, in principle, discard, or eventually somebody's going to discard an eight. I would draw that, and the six could melt with the other eight, potentially. So, yeah. Still no call. Yeah, because that wouldn't be three hidden pair, uh, three hidden pawn. Green dragon. Green dragon. Well, I don't have another green dragon. Somebody, nobody's discarded any of those yet. Somebody might be collecting it, but I don't need to care right now. Yeah, I have no hope of collecting the green dragons. Six bamboo does not go with anything I have. I've already discarded a five, so tossing the six to me makes sense. Um... That would be my guess. You have three outs. So one has to do with circles. Um, yeah, the six is not useful to me. So we gotta, yeah. This is not part of my outs. That's colorful. That's a five. Many fives are red. Now I've got a purple button there. I don't actually know what the purple button is. <laughs> Um, but we got two, three, four, five, six, triple eight, triple uh, bamboo, and a pair, and oh, it's Ricci. It doesn't say Ricci, but yeah, I had, it's okay. And this is asking me what to discard, right? Because I only have one option to discard here, which would be the South Wind. Yeah. Okay, cool. And then the game plays itself. And we don't have to worry about making further mistakes. This is the best part. Sumo! Boom! I don't claim to understand how, but we'll take it. No, I played it right away. I pushed the button because I knew this call screen would show up. Um, so, from this screen, we can see I've got a trio of eight, a trio of one, uh, two, three, four, five, six, and then this and that, a pair. So, I don't know how that works. Um, so, that's a... Uh, three eight circle, three one bamboo, a pair, and then this five run. And somewhere in there is the yoku, which I think is the five. And yeah, I don't know how any of the rest of this works. <laughs> yeah, so up here, this determines the ura, dora, or whatever. Um, or this determines dora. I don't know what Oradora is, but the Yaku is the Ricci. Oh! Ricci is a Yaku? Well, that's nice. Yeah, we'll just aim for Ricci every time. <laughs> yeah, a concealed Ricci is worth more points. I see. But okay, Ricci is the Yaku, so that's how we were able to do that. Yeah, all concealed sumo self draw was. Uh, worth bonus points. Okay, wait, so that's the bonus tile. Okay, so Ricci was the Yaku, but there's the one bonus tile. We don't have any other bonus tiles. We don't have Dora or Dora or whatever. Um, now, the scoring. So we have, I think, call here refers to having the Yoku. So meaning I was eligible to go out. We got one bonus tile. 
And then, yeah, like you pointed out, completely drawn from the wall. Didn't get any help from anyone there. Um, it says one doubles, one doubles, one. I don't know how this... It says, it says three doubles here. So I assume this means that when I played Ricci there, Ricci me, gave me the call, but all these multiply my score uh, somehow. Um, when you win with Ricci, oh, then you flip this tile up on the wall. Okay. Yeah, the tile that's underneath that. Like, they stack these too high. Um, those are Uradora. Okay, cool. Nice. So if I had to figure out how to score this, though... So, we get one point, or one double, and then we have a bonus tile that's another double, and we have a concealed... Having drawn it all from the walls, another double. And there was some number in the middle at the beginning of the round, and as the dealer keeps getting moved around, that number in the middle is whatever it is. So we took that number in the middle and multiplied it by three, I guess. One for the call, one for the bonus, and one for self-draw. That's how we came up with this 5200 number, is that right? Oh. <laughs> oh, thank you. Welcome. You'll be watching your stream while you work out for a diet. Oh, that's quite exciting. Yeah, this is my first time playing Mahjong. Abigail has most generously been patiently coaching me through this. Um, Abigail, our uh, French shogi player and one Don, uh, also happens to know a tremendous deal about uh, Mahjong strategy. So that's pretty cool. But yeah, welcome Yamachiro. <laughs> Or Tudon, I apologize. Yeah, that's a recent achievement. Congratulations on it. Oh, come on. Have some confidence. You'll keep it. <laughs> yeah, I was really nervous when I promoted and didn't think I'd keep it either. But, eh. It's fine. So, one Han for Ricci. One for All Concealed. One for Dora. Yeah, it's a nice game. I still don't know how the, the scoring works. Maybe the details of that don't matter so much. But each Han here multiplies the amount that was shown on this number at the beginning of the round. So I have three Han. Um, so three times whatever that number was becomes 5,200. And then I guess you just have a baseline of 1,000. And then I don't know what the 4DP refers to. That's the Ricci stick, as best as I can tell. I don't know. Um, okay, sure. That's fine. We'll get to it some other day. I apologize. That makes perfect sense. But you get a lot more points if you get all the bonuses. So that's the key part. Uh, the other key part is not losing the round and winning the round. So... Woo! All right. Still third place, even after tremendous assist. But, uh, yeah. Everybody has to pay out. I drew this from the wall. If I had done Ron instead of Sumo, then one of these folks would have to pay out. But, no, I drew that from the wall, so... Uh... Oh! Back to title screen. All right. So that's my first, uh, game. I forget if I set this to four or eight rounds. It feels like it's been eight rounds. I'm definitely ready to go again. I don't know if you'd recommend four or eight rounds for the next time I try this. But yeah, this game's Mahjong no Gomi. Um, and I announced the publisher at the beginning of this. So you can find it on Steam. Um, oh, it's a remainder from the previous draw round, which I guess overflowed or was a drawn or for previous drawn round yeah i see yeah i forgot that there was a previous draw round i knew that like several rounds ago there was a draw round but good to know so yeah this keeps track of your rating performance whatever i don't know 
Um, I could blast through it. Um, but yeah, there you can get this game on Steam. Obviously, it's like two bucks. Uh, it seems pretty nice. I saw Rack the Kitty, uh, R A C underscore the underscore K I T T Y. Uh, he also plays Mahjong. I encouraged him to do a uh, round of this yesterday. It's, uh, it's like the second time I've seen him do it. And he's explaining things, and obviously I'm picking up a little bit, but really not picking up most of it. I'm getting slightly better at recognizing the digits 1 through 9 on the character or man tiles. So, yeah, I'll go back to the title. I don't know if there's single player is campaign based or like what record is record just indicating okay so for four round games single player this is my record for eight round games this is my record so we see that on the whole i'm down uh minus eight thousand points on average or i'm sorry that's my pay average score so um, draw what conclusions you will. Oh, this keeps track of Yaku across... I don't know whether it's round 4, round 8, or just in general, but... These are all the special little things that are super hard to remember every single one of them. And you can also find in the settings menu here... Uh, there's all these rule options if you want to do all the super complicated rules. <laughs> and I opted out of that. Um, but yeah, you have to calculate the foo of your hand. Yeah, so the foo, the foot soldiers, or whatever. And Shogi, yeah, we talk about the pawn being the foo, or the pawn being a farmer, but, um, I could be mistaken. But calculate whatever that quantity, okay, it's a different foo. Lovely. It's such a poetic language. You calculate the foo of your hand, you round the foo score to the higher dozen, and then apply Han to double the foo score. Oh, so each Han is literally a doubler. So, yeah, we had the call, and then we had a doubler and another doubler, and that produced 5,200 from 13. From Somehow the math worked. It's... Well, roughly up there. But each of those is actually a doubler, not an increment to be multiplied. Okay, that's cool. Uh, yeah, I'm totally up for playing another round of this. Uh, let's see, if I check my clock, it is extremely late where you're at. But um, I'm just going to do single player then. Would you recommend that I do four round or eight round? So you have options here for four or eight. Surprisingly, that's in the settings menu instead of like you'd hit the player button and then pick one. I don't know why that's in the settings menu. I guess everybody always plays eight round or just plays four round all the time. But like eight's the default. But eight games could run uh, like an hour and a half. And I don't know. I'm willing to do another hour and a half or something of this, but um, I wouldn't require you to be there. I'd be glad to have you, of course, but um, anyway, I'm trying to figure out what next to try here. Um, I don't mind doing eight. It'd be fun. I'm just starting to get into this. Um, I've done, I mean, I've done a live stream of TIS 100. A programming puzzle game. It's been absolutely maddening, and um, I have the patience to endure that sort of thing, so yeah, I don't mind having an intensely difficult puzzle. Um, and compared to that, this is a cakewalk. Uh, TIS 100's a mess, and other programming puzzle games are even worse, but anyway. Um, so you're explaining Yaku give you different amounts of Han. Oh. And each Han's a doubler? Wow. 
all three of a kind gives you two Han, so that's a quadruple score. And you accumulate Yaku. Wow, that's amazing. <laughs> that's why from five Han, you reach limit scores. I see. Yes. Oh, I could see why they would do that. That's still kind of funny. Um, yeah, so if you were to unlock all of these, just imagine how many things you could get. <laughs> no, but a lot of these things are probably quite difficult to get. Um, all right, should I pick four or eight rounds for my next game? Do you have a preference? Um, my default preference would be to take the default setting here. Which would be eight, but um, I could also try the Twitch feature of poll the audience and see if the audience has a preference. But that's you're the one chatting here. <laughs> um, the poll would like put a definite end to the poll and let me pick something and move on. <laughs> Just keep the exposed all simples. Yeah, you probably want to keep that one. I think most of the red bonus tiles are also, um, those are mostly five tiles. And I don't know that the red dragon counts as a red bonus. Yeah. Uh, but it seems fun to keep some kind of action there. All right, I'm just going to pick eight and continue. And let me know if I've done that incorrectly. But here we go. East round one. So, um, yeah, what's this frog thing, by the way? Is that an eight? I think I've seen real life sets. And that, wait, no, this is a one, two, three, four, yeah. So this is a four, and this is a four with four more in between, so that's an eight. An eight of bamboo. Okay, cool. So this east round one, we are in west position. Uh, this determines the Dora to be nine. And here, got two south winds and a west wind. South winds would not help me go out, but I got two of them. Um, so we're collecting something already. But to go out, I would need to collect west winds or some other uh, Yaku. So we got three, four, whatever this number, six, I think. Um, and then I got the one, three, four, six. Got the one here, which looks pretty useless. But here we see they've discarded a one and a nine already. Um, <laughs> yeah. I'll go for Richi Pinfu. As it seems. Yeah. So. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it would help to know what any of the words meant. I know what the Ricci is. I've heard on a broadcast American Ricci, that term, Pinfu. And they've also talked about these circles being pins, but, um, yeah, it's a poetic language. Um, so I, I'm pretty sure the one here is completely useless to me. Um, sure. Okay. I can be patient. I'm grateful. I'm quite impressed at your patience <laughs> must have the following requirements and it's true at the beginning of this look i've done youtube i've done multiple video series on youtube of me just trying to solve a game without following any of the instructions uh for example i've got a series where i'm playing keep talking and nobody explodes 
which is a puzzle game that has to do with diffusal. And so, um, yeah, with that game, it's not really viable to do that as a single player. You're supposed to have somebody else guiding you through it. But nevertheless, it's good content. But no, this is a literal game that is quite well respected by many, many players. This is not some silly puzzle, so I should take this more seriously. So Pinfu has the following requirements. No call. All sequence melds and a pair. Okay, so yeah, got that. Your pair must not be dragons, or your seat wind, or the rounds wind. Okay, so that's what the pair of south wind are useful for here. So, yeah, all sequences plus the pair, and no calling. Okay, cool. Must wait on a double sided wait. Yeah, so if I want sequences, um, yeah, aiming for a sequence with a hole in the middle is not a good strategy. There, for example, here I've got one, three, four, six. So right now I'm, I'd be aiming for a two. And otherwise, if I don't get a 2, the 1 is useless. But, um, yeah, likewise, here we got 1, 4, 8. And we got we just drew a 6. So this, we would need to draw both a 2 and a 3 for the 1 here to be useful. So like this, yeah, we want to draw, want to have sequences that, similar to poker, would draw on either end. Um, so... All those requirements gives me no foo. Oh, pin foo means zero foo. Okay, cool. Interesting. Yep. So I'm pretty sure the one bamboo is the correct discard here. Um, because we just drew a six. I mean, 4, 6, 8 is not perfect, but the 1 is next to useless in this case. Um, the West Wind might be even more useless. Well, no, the West Wind I could be used as the Yaku if I drew out another West Wind and another one. So, yeah. I'm going to discard the 1 Bamboo. Okay, so now I've drawn a 9. So we have 8, 9. Um, let me see. Yeah, all sequences in a pair. A pair must not be the dragons or the seat wind or the round wind. And must wait on a double sided weight. So, double sided weight, does that mean I cannot use ones or nines? One bamboo or the west. Yeah, I'm sorry, you mentioned that last. I'm rereading your message. Sorry. Um, let me check my overlay. Overlay actually still looks fine. I'm impressed. Uh, cat's still there and it's still entertaining. So, uh, yeah, I think at this... <laughs> yeah, my odds of drawing enough wests to go out as a backup plan or as a different way to get the yaku it does not seem like the best formed plan here double-sided weight yeah okay um right so you mentioned uh Yeah, so that's a strategy, and a very, very good strategy. So, like, waiting on 8-9 is not a good strategy. Because 8-9, I'd be waiting for a 7, but I'm already waiting on a 7. Plus, somebody's already... Two 9s have already been discarded. Yeah, so the 9 bamboo here is not useful. Um... 
any other kind of weight would give me two foo. Uh, sorry. Hmm. <laughs> so the rules for this particular thing are not just based on what I collect, but also based on how I wait for it. Or is it just that waiting for a single ended wait is not strategic? Sorry if that's not making sense. Um, I'll try to rephrase the question. Um, so keeping the nine seems very much not strategic here, but also like would keeping the nine prevent me from being able to, uh, employ that strategy? Uh, three, five is a central weight on four and give me two foos for my basic score before applying the Hans. Okay. What if next turn I draw the four in that situation? So, like, then I'm not waiting anymore. Is that still giving me a foo, even though nobody has any idea how I got three, four, five? Um, like, would a central weight prevent me from winning? Or is it just extremely not strategic? I, um, like here I've got one, three in circles. Uh, it prevent me from winning with Pinfu. Okay. Wow. So in this case, would one, three also prevent me from winning with Pinfu? Like, am I forced to discard the one? Just because I don't have the two yet, I, you know, I can in the future I could get the two. Nobody would know whether I got the one before I got the two. Um, oh, but I could still go for Ricci. That's true. Anyway, we're gonna discard this. This is useless. Um. Oh, applies for the winning tile. Thank you. That helps make sense. Okay, cool. So here I drew the... Uh, that's the east wind. I keep calling it an incense, but no, it's an east wind. Um, so this is the east round, um, but I've already got the west wind, so why would I need the east wind? It's even less, well, oh, oh boy. So yeah, Pinfu, if I'm eventually doing Pinfu, I cannot be using either of those two wind tiles in my Pinfu. Um, both tiles individually right now could be useful if I draw one more of either of those. I think, even though very soon I'm likely to discard west or east, probably this turn I should still discard circle one. Ah, as in perfume or incense. Nice. Yeah. I'm thinking the one circle, or one pin, is what I should be discarding here. Um, and that very soon I'm likely to discard either west or east. Um, even though theoretically those could yaku, but, um, you throw the east. Yeah, I don't need the east. And likely everybody's going to hold on to their east much more than they would hold on to a west. So yeah, throwing the east makes, improves my chances here. That makes sense. Okay, now I have two west. 
like you mentioned, for Pinfu, I would not be able to be using a West, but an alternate Yaku would be to have three West. Um, yeah, if I draw two, I could still use the one circle. So this is a six. I've got, if I get two or a five, then I'm good there. But if I get like three, four, five, six, seven, whatever, two, three, four, five, six, seven, that would be excellent also. Um, a one has been discarded, but for Pinfu, I'm not like trying to collect pawn. So yeah, we can go for three west. We don't have to say that we're absolutely definitely always going to go for three west, but we can make that one of the things that we aim for here. And it seems like a good thing to try to aim for, whether or not I hit it. It gives me some chances. Um, yeah, three west and Ricci could also work. So we are aiming either for three west and Ricci or for Pinfu. Both are feasible here. Um, in either case, the one circle seems like a terrible thing to hold on to. Um, unless there's something worse. <sighs> Let's see. I mean, so we have a four and a six and an eight. That's not per... Uh... But yeah, the one circle's useless here, because I already have three, four. Unless I were to draw a two and a five. If I got a two and a five, that would be something. Huh. Uh, so maybe the six is the most... I don't know. Yeah, actually, we got a lot of circles. The six might be the most useless, but... No, this, these... Bamboo are also hard to work with. We have multiple gaps. This is just not an easy decision, other than we know we're keeping the West for now. Um, yeah. The one and six circle, as well as the six character, could be discarded. All right. So my rationale is somebody's already discarded this and discarded that. Um, circles seem harder to work with here than the character although the character could go but circles seem much harder to work with at present so yeah i would start with the one and then the six and then the six character that would be my guess and what preference i would have for discarding these um which again could be completely off base i don't know but that's where I would start. Um, but yeah, like you point out, all three of those are options for discard. Uh, the one seems like a pretty clear option because doing anything with the one is challenging. Uh, or keep the one as a safe tile. That's a cool idea. So if I'm keeping the one as a safe tile, then I would default to throwing the six character first. And then maybe eventually discarding the four circle. Um, so yeah, I think right now this is probably the best discard, like you're saying. Obviously, there's a lot of randomness in this game. We can't strategize everything perfectly. But I think this seems like a, quite a reasonable discard right now. So let's do this. Uh, oh, <laughs> okay. Well, so you mentioned Ricci as a Yaku. Re West Winds is also a Yaku. But somebody else has another West Wind. But I could get my Yaku right now. Um, But if I do this, then does that disqualify me for Pinfu? Um... Yes, I would not be able to pinfu if I have the West Wind. So this would change my strategy. Um, yeah, I could wait for the last West Wind. Yeah, I don't need to put rush it. 
Plus, it's not clear what I would be doing at that point. So, yeah, that's fine. Okay, we drew another three. Uh, that's not useful for Pinfu. So I should probably discard the three. Assuming that I'm trying to keep my options open, trying to keep Pinfu on the table. Yeah. Oh, that's good to know. Cool. All right, I'm going to do this. You're going to yell at me for it. <laughs> Now let's do this. Uh, uh, so we got another six. I'm again trying to keep Pinfu on the table. Um, I mean, heck, there's a nine discarded already. There's a nine, there's a nine. All four nines have been discarded. Hmm. <laughs> my head. <laughs> oh, my head. No, we're going to try to keep go aiming for Pinfu. Oh. Okay, this person drew three East Winds, and they're the East player. So they can't do Pinfu, but they have Yaku. Alright, so now we've got a North Wind, I think. Um, which to B seems completely useless. They have two Han. Oh, okay, you should not think about Pinfu anymore. All right, cool. Yeah, Pinfu early in the game would have made sense. Here, it's getting much, much harder because there's all these gaps in my sequences. So I should just uh, focus on trying to get something anything at all. Alright. So... Hmm. <laughs> this is not great. <laughs> this is not great. Um, I think the one circle is probably the best discard here. Oh, yeah. Unless I were to get both a 2 and a 5. That said, I might be able to get both a 2 and a 5. I don't know that yet. Um, throw the 6 of circle. Okay. I'm totally open to this. I see a 3 and a 3 have already been discarded, so... I mean, the 6 is quite difficult to use. Yeah, let's... This is not my greatest hand ever. Let's not overthink it. Alright, so Richi... It's different than Chi, obviously, but yeah, Richi would be me still getting one away. Um, and that would qualify as a Yaku. Um, I don't know that this... Yeah, we don't call it here. It's just so that's a seven. I can't use the seven, so I discard it. No. <laughs> Nicely played, Long sir. Long Long. Damn. Uh, yeah, that was incautious of me. I deserved it. All right. That's what happens when, yeah, it's a cheap hand. That's, we survive. Interesting. East round one. All right, we've got two east winds already. Perfect. Um, somebody discarded an east wind before I could draw my second east. Uh, why? Why did you have to... I'm sorry, that's South. South Wind doesn't qualify here as Yaku. Um, that somebody discarded a South already. Yeah, it's a pair. Pairs are nice. This has got a pair of three, but yeah, this is going to be a pair I can hold on to. 
We got five five six eight eight nine one three three six eight and then some bamboo. Bamboo seems useless here. Unless there's something even more useless, but I don't think so. One's pretty bad. Although one, two, three is a possibility, so yeah, this doesn't combine with anything. So it goes. Maybe throw the nine character away. Oh yeah! This is not going to combine well either. Let's toss that away. Yeah, that's not... nothing's changed with respect to that in the last turn. Okay, now we have a four bamboo. Maybe I hold on to that, I don't know. Um... I see somebody's already discarded one five. Uh, I've got a... Tr okay, so we're on our way here. We got one pawn. We're close to another pawn over here, and a third pawn. This is not helping. Throw the one circle away. Yes, that makes sense. Okay, we got a seven. So, we got five, five, six, seven, eight, eight. Um, so, I can read, <laughs> can read that multiple ways here. Um... I could read that as five, six, seven, eight, which is not a thing as far as I know, but um, five, six, seven, eight could build out to three, four, five, six, seven, eight, or four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, uh, or potentially it could just be multiple pairs. Also, maybe we get seven pairs. What are the odds? But yeah, throw a south and keep the other south as a safe tile. All right, yeah. No objection. Um, keep the other south as a safe tile. We're going to keep it. So we have a two and a four, which is not good, but it's not bad. Um, got a six and an eight circle. Uh, crap. I think there are a lot of options here. Or rather... Um, I th think the two, the two bamboo, as well as the eight circle, both look bad here. It's just a question of which one looks worse. Okay, we can aim for all simples. I think I can get seven pairs of pawns. <laughs> uh, yeah. I, I, yeah. I like to live up the drama, but throw an eight of character. Interesting. Okay. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm fine with that. Uh, what? Oh, that's a nine. So, yeah, chi in general is bad in many cases. In this case, that would be seven, eight, nine, uh, which is not that useful because I already have six, seven, eight. I don't need seven, eight, nine. It would prevent me from getting all simple. Yeah, this would be terrible to chi. Um,. All right, do I... Mm. So many options. Means I'm playing well, but... Um, it also means the decisions get much harder. Uh, ugh. This is a hard decision for me. I'm tempted to discard the eight circle. Um, or yeah, the last south, and go for speed. Yeah, speed seems awesome here, because my speed is very, very high. Yeah. Um, yeah, a one is useless. 
Well, I'm sorry. Now that's a one bamboo. We have a one. Well, we would not get all simple if we kept the one. So. Oh no, that's that's perfect. Sorry, I apologize if I said anything contrary. Um. Uh, how do I say that? Um. No, your your sentence was very funny. It was very good. It was humorous. It was enjoyable. It, it's not strange. Um, plus, I'm still learning the game, so I don't know like how to talk about the game. Uh, uh, so, yeah, I think I discard the one, right? Like, I'd be crazy to keep the one, I think. Because then I can't get all simple. Um, I don't have a Yaku other than all simple. Not that I'm aware of. So, I mean, seven pairs would still be funny. But I'm nowhere near seven pairs. Yeah. Yeah, so the one's useless for all simple. So let's, just for fun, discard the one. White dragon. Okay, white dragon is not useful for me. It would... I don't even know if that's a... Well, two problems. One, maybe a white dragon's a Yaku. I don't know. I don't know the Yaku. <laughs> so maybe it's useful. But also it seems hard to get all the white dragons. But no... There are 39 tiles still in the wall. Let's see this counter for 39. So either the other players have white dragons or the white dragons are still in the wall. So I could try to fetch or fish for another dragon. Uh, but that's kind of silly. But if it's Yaku, then like it's not so silly anymore. Uh, so here we got a whole lot of nothing. <laughs> uh, I just don't know. Oh, no, we're saying we're going for speed. If I'm going for speed, then I don't keep the dragon. Um, dragon is going to be anything but speedy here. Yeah. Yeah, like you say, I'm not aiming for that. That's not speedy. Ah, see, they were holding them anyway. What? No. Excuse me? How is that a thing? What? But, but, okay. I'm obviously going to click that, but I have to figure out how I'm winning this, just for my own understanding. Here's a pair. Six, seven, eight. Here's three of a kind, uh, junk, and then two, three, and another pair? What is this devilry? I don't understand. Oh, this is Ricci. Waiting for the seven a circle. Okay, so it's waiting for an inside straight. Or a run with a gap in the middle. Yeah. Um, I guess uh, that's Yaku right there. I want this, right? Or do I not want this? I mean, almost certainly I want this because, like, I need to be able to exit this game. Yes. Okay. I am delighted to see this as an option because I don't have to think about it. Is this a good move? <laughs> I assume, like, it's not a bad thing. And I assume it's my best chance, right? I'm also... F oh, yeah, delaying Ricci would make no sense. Because it's still the same thing. Yeah, okay. 
sorry, I'm new to the game, and now it's starting to dawn on me why you would never want to delay Ricci. Yeah. So, let's do this without delay. And this prompts me, which thing do you want to discard? They're identical. So, yep, there we go. Oh, the, when I mouse over, that's showing me what I need to win. Okay. Those are... Okay. That's interesting. I was questioning at the beginning. Yeah, what does that require to win? There we go. And like you said, the seven circle is what I was waiting for. Yes. Yeah. So declaring Ricci early... Not only, like, there's no reason to delay it. There, you would get no advantage from waiting. But also, having played Ricci, um, or having called Ricci, then other players are forced to play defensively. Whereas if you were to delay it, and again, there's no reason to delay it, because you're still, you're still going to discard the four bamboo. And you're still going to be waiting on the seven circle. There's no reason to delay, but, um, yeah, I didn't realize, uh, Ricci's powerful because there are three opponents you could run against. You're essentially getting to work with the entire deck here, instead of getting to work with one, well, anyway. I mean, maybe the whole game, you're able to work with these tiles from other players, but Ricci makes it much more powerful. Um, oh yeah, we got the Uradora bonus. Nice. Sorry I missed that. <laughs> um, oh my gosh. Uh, so, you had a south, a north, a red dragon. Oh, a red dragon is a Yaku. Oh no, it's a bonus tile. Sorry, it's a bonus tile. A bonus tile's already been discarded. I don't need to worry too much about bonuses. I just need to worry about, like, completing rounds. Um, so, here, uh, going for all simple seems like a good strategy for me. Um, in order to go for all simple, there would be no ones, no nines. So I think discarding the nine bamboo makes sense. Um, the north tile is useless. Oh, oh, that's right. Yeah, let's start there. Yeah, I have no use for the north tile. And so let's discard this before the north player has too many of them. Um, and so they can't pawn this because they don't have two yet. So the north is useless to me, and now it's useless to them because I've already discarded it. Um, some points about speed at the beginning. Hmm. I mean, this is like need for speed here, like... You could say what you want strategically about what is a good play, but there's also something that could be said for what's an entertaining play. Something that's going to make everybody at the table laugh. So, discard useless wins for speed, then discard unconnected extremities, ones and nines, and if you see on the table that all the ones are gone, then consider the twos, but the ones and nines prevent you from doing all simples, so... Yeah, and disconnected extremities can go. Uh, yeah. So here, south wind is useful since I'm the south player, so I don't discard that, but ones and nines for speed um, are useful to discard. I have one and three here, so I'm not going to immediately discard the one, but the nine can go. I don't need the 9 for speed. There could be other strategic reasons to keep a 9. But, no. Strategy is overrated. Um, so yeah, now... 
The one is disconnected. Six is disconnected. Uh, but we have this pair. Hmm. One's not completely disconnected. Um, then for speed, if you're going for speed, after having discarded useless wins and ones and nines, then discard dragons, and then for speed you can consider uh, discarding relevant wins if you, oh, speed is all that matters at the beginning. If that's true. So... Uh, I'm thinking here that I should discard the one. Well, yeah, for speed. Like we're saying. It's not connected. There's a gap between the one and the three. It's a very small gap, but it is a gap. And it would prevent me from getting all simples. Um, yeah, okay, speed does matter, but yeah, if you can't quickly assemble a hand, then consider slowing down, and uh, if you're slowing down, then keep some save tiles. That makes sense. All right, so you got three, four, five, 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 eight, there's a nine, which is not a disconnected nine. It's actually a connected nine. Um, that's a set. Is that a seven or a nine? That's a nine they've discarded here. That's a nine that's also discarded here. So the nine, even though it's connected, is pretty bad. Unless I got seven, eight, nine. Uh, but if I'm getting a seven. I'm almost as likely to get six, seven, eight, nine as I'm likely to get seven, eight, nine. I don't know. Um, yeah. So at some point you would keep hold on to defensive tiles. All right. I'm going to keep trying for all simples just for fun. Might not. What? Oh, that's a five. Three, four, five is awesome. Three, four, five, six, 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 and an eight. I don't need the eight, but also this. No, I don't need the eight. Now uh, we are still in the first six turns, so I'm still close to a, having assembled a hand. Um. But maybe not as close as I think I am. Um, oh yeah, also... Uh, oh, this is a bonus tile. Right. Get rid of the red dragon before it embarrasses you. It's the Dora. Oh! That's a green dragon, which makes this okay. Yeah, so this holding on to this, if I had two of it, I could hold on to that, but it's just going to embarrass me here because other players already have them. So yeah, we want to discard the Dora unless we're able to collect it, and we're not, so I wouldn't bank on collecting it here. I don't need that tile. There's another one of those out there. Pawn is not the right move here, but when the second three comes around, pawn might be correct. But here, it just limits my options rather than expanding them. Um, yeah, we're gonna say no on that. We drew the white dragon. For speed, it's still not useful. It is a safe discard. No, it's, I don't know if it is or not, but it's not useful for speed. Boom. All right. So here, now we consider slowing down a bit, a little bit. We consider it, maybe we don't slow down though. 
we have to consider, but we don't necessarily do that. So we got three, four, five, six, 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 and eight floating about. We have some circles that have one gap in the middle. We got a pair and a pair and a dragon. All right, so seven pairs not happening. Seven pairs a meme. Um. Yeah, we're gonna keep the south as a safe tile. We might eventually. Well, odds on drawing another south are really low but it is a good safe discard so we're gonna keep it so yeah um looking at the table some nines have already been discarded for nine character so the odds of getting seven eight nine are low i'm thinking eight character is my discard here um yeah, let's discard eight character. Okay, pawn of three. So that's the second uh discard for a three. So if I don't pawn this, then I'm not gonna be able to get three of that. So okay, we're gonna pawn that. Yep. Because otherwise we don't get to pawn that. Um throw this out yep all right yep we're gonna try to play speedily here okay that's oh well <laughs> oh well 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 hang on full speed ahead no um jeez don't pawn okay i don't have enough speed here it's overly aggressive for me to pawn that. Okay. Oh, on seven circle, I'm winning. Let me see. Obviously, I'm not going to hit the pawn button. I'm just looking. So I've got one. I've got three of these. I've got a run here. So on seven, yeah, seven circle would win. Um. Wait. Yeah. Still trying to do the math. Obviously, don't pawn that. Oh. Wait. That's... I'm trying to figure out how Seven Circle wins here. Sorry, I thought I had it. We've got three threes. We've got a run here. We've got another set of three. And this would be another run. This would be... Like... Th three of a kind... Three of a kind, run and a run. Um, I didn't. Oh, that's all simples. That's my Yoku. Okay, yeah. But wait, if all simples is a Yoku, then why doesn't pawn also run? Why is that not a winning play to take that? I'm already in Tenpai. Yes, you're right. Why is taking this not a winning play, though? That's... sorry. I'm already in a very good situation here. I'm already in Tenpai. Why is taking that not a winning play? I'm stuck with a 6 or an 8. Oh! Wait. But, okay, if I draw a seven of circle. Oh, I see the pair now. Okay, my god. Okay, this is the pair. If I pawn, I don't have a pair anymore. Okay, thank you. Thank you, yeah. So I need... All right. <laughs> All right, so it's going to be either the four or the eight. Uh... Uh, yeah, I don't know how to make that decision. I don't know. Uh, I guess if the goal is all simple, eight is close to nine, and nines have already been discarded, so we want to discard the eight. Uh, yes. Can still win on a red five for an extra Han. 
I'm trying to think about that too. I can still win on... Oh, I see. Yeah, if I were to draw a two character, this would provide me an extra Han or something. Yeah, but the eight's got to go. Yeah, and this identifies that if I discard the eight, a five wins. If I discard the four, a seven wins, but no. Yeah, this gives me options that if I were to draw a three and then I could draw two, things could happen. Um, yeah, this four bamboo is useless. Yeah, we're still waiting. Nobody's called Ricci. Green dragon, again, not useful. Unless that's some kind of Yoku thing I don't know about. Um, but still, I'd need like two green dragons. One's already stuck here. So this would be an extremely far difficult reach to do. We'll just stay in Tenpai. Okay, that would be not Ron. This would be Chi. It's still not correct. I'm trying to read the number on the tile. That's a five. I think. Um, so that would give me three, four, five as my chi. Or some, if I were stupid enough, I could break. Uh, yeah, I already have a pair of six bamboo. I don't need a, I don't want to split up this. So we'd be talking about three, four, five as the chi. But I've already got three, four, five. I don't need that. Um, yes, yeah, so we just say no. All right, so like I was saying, discarding the eight earlier, like you advised, is correct because here we got a three. And so now that we've got the three, we can just, we, if it's safe, and nobody's called Ricci yet, so it is safe, I could discard this six here, giving me two winning options. Yep. There we go. Thank you. Uh, again, that's chi. Ooh. Wait. It's not useful. I've already got 3, 4, 5. I don't need 2, 3, 4. That's useless. Alright, this is Ricci. Uh... This is... How... How is this Ricci? <laughs> Okay, we got four of a kind, which is some sort of thing I don't know about. Um, and we've got a pair. Uh, I could con this. Is that what the purple button is this time? Is con... Re I don't know. I just... I'm very confused. Definitely con. Is that what the purple button is? Is con here? Con is... Oh, I'm sorry. Con is play all four of a kind. That's what con is. Yeah. It's safe to click. Yeah, so con is four of a kind. We definitely con the four of a kind. Oh, this is how you show that on the board. Is that we did this with a con. So, yeah, that's why two of them are face down. Uh, one... Uh, this is useless. Yeah, we still can win with... Two or five. This again, useless. Still two or five would be our win condition. Run. Yeah. Um, I'm doing the math. Three, four, five. Three, four, five. And a pair. And that's how this is run. Yeah. Let's do it. Woo! On a red five, too. <laughs> too bad, no Uradora. Yeah. You're mentioning how if we were to sumo, then we get the p possibility of Uradora. Okay. This is taking me a minute to pick up the language, but so we got all simples, which was our Yaku. That allows us to win the round. And then we got two bonus tiles. And didn't get any other bonuses, but 
That's it's interesting that con itself is not a bonus. Who knew? Um, woo! We're winning. Definitely not cheating. <laughs> All right. Hey, we got a bonus tile. All right. So, reading notes earlier. Who ate the squid? Welcome. That's a good username. Some people say like all the good names are taken. I just say they're not being creative enough. Um, that said, I had tremendous creativity problems coming up with my own thing. All right, so rules for speed. If you care very heavily about speed in the opening, and you usually do. Um, so I'm scrolling up. Because Abigail gave a good guidance about what to do for speed. Uh, if I care about speed, and I do. Um, some points about speed. One, discard useless wins. Then discard unconnected extremities, ones and nines. Then, for speed, discard dragons. And then, after dragons, relevant wins. Or dragons and relevant wins, but probably dragons first. And then, um, yeah, if you can't... Uh, assemble a hand quickly, then start doing safe things, because other players are playing faster. Alright, so one. Useless wins. We are in East, round three. I am player East. Every wind other than East is useless to me. So, useless wins. In terms of most useless... So I don't want to play... I would want to discard the west first and then the north because I want to give problems to the person on my right and then give problems to the next person and give problems to the next person. I'm in the dealer position here, so I want to give the most problems first to the players who get the most turns. And north is going to get the fewest turns. So, yeah, we're going to discard the... So here we got a west wind, so the west is going to go first. It's useless to me. Then north is useless to me. Um, a nine pawn. Now I'm nowhere near, yeah, there's going to be another nine at some point. Unless some dick holds on to it. But no, we don't pawn that. Pump. Um, okay, this person already got a trio of south winds, and they are in the south position. So that's a little scary, but it's not so bad. Um, we've got three, four, five bamboo. We've got one bamboo. The one bamboo is useless. So we discard the one bamboo. Um. Oh my god. What? Okay, this game is all over the place. So that's a six. Uh, well, a seven pair is not happening. I know we got a pair here, we got a pair there. Um... There's going to be another six tile. I don't need to pawn this one. Yeah. You prefer throwing north first? Because if north calls pawn, south and west get to... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's really funny. <laughs> yeah, so if they call pawn. Yeah, that's that would be amazing if that happened. But... Uh, uh, that's funny. Yeah, so, got three safe tiles. We don't want to stir the pot here. Uh, the aggressive thing would be to chi. Aggressive move is wrong. Um, okay, three safe tiles. The nine circle 
because ain't nobody collecting nines or able to use nines. And the two and six character. Oh, yeah, so the six character has been discarded, so the six character would be a safe discard. Uh, yeah, or two sixes of characters, yes, right. Um, so this would be a disaster if I were to take that, or it would be stupid for me to take, because I'd be getting rid of one of my safe discards. I need to play defensively here. <laughs> here. Um, so, in whatever order I decide, um, uh, so potentially I could still draw another six here. So we're going to discard the nine for, it's safer to discard the six first. But no, potentially, if they have a 7 and an 8, and they shouldn't. They really shouldn't, because then they wouldn't have discarded this. Yeah, the longer I wait to... Di well, they discarded this too. There's, they have no use for either of these two tiles. Um, and the reason we know that is because they declared Ricci. If they had a use for these, they wouldn't have discarded them. Oh, yeah, you're right. The East Wind is also a safe discard. Yeah, so the ordering here doesn't matter much. Um, yeah, in terms of my... No, I, I don't have many chances to go out. Um, I've already got a pair of nine. So... Uh... Yeah, the 8 here is useless if I discard the 9, but the 9 is a safe discard. Um, we're going to discard a 6 first. Okay, that's a 6. I don't need that. I'm going to say no. Um, there's my 7, 8, 9 draw that I hoped for. That said... Again, we're playing defensively, but not giving up all chances of winning the round, because that's no fun. Uh, so, six is the next one to discard, then the nine, or the six, and then maybe the east wind, and then the nine. Um, explain the footy ten rules. So, discard the east. Okay. <laughs> just pawn everything to win at noob levels. Yeah, that's perhaps not a terrible idea. Um, they can't win on a nine circle. Oh, right. Sorry, you did explain footy 10 earlier. So yeah, they're unable to win on nine circle. Um, it's a safe discard. So I'm... Yes, I want to discard that, but now I have seven, eight, nine. I want my chances of winning the round are next to zero, but I don't want to make them zero because that's no fun. But um, yeah, toy, toy for the win. Oh, okay. So sorry. One east was probably discarded, so east is probably safe. Uh, oh, yeah, that's right, and East was already discarded. So, yeah, let's do this. Um, okay. So, do I discard the 9 now? To aim for all simples, like you are saying? Um, sorry if I'm all over the place here, and what I'm asking doesn't make sense. Um, they discarded a 2. They discarded a 9, but... Mm, 4 of circle is safe. Oh yeah, there's 4 circle. Right, they discarded 4 circle, so I can also discard it. Um... Yeah, we don't need that. 
one bamboo. So what? Oh, there's the second nine. Um, so if I'm collecting a trio of nines, now's the time to take it. Uh, but alternatively, this means that nine is a safe discard. Um, so, uh, I might consider throwing red dragons next, but now I know that nine is a safe discard. So now, instead of discarding the red dragons next, the nines... I mean, that reduces my winning chances for this round to next to zero. Because uh, I'd have to get a five. But, um... Yeah. Uh, do I pawn? Transport was saying just pawn everything to win at noob levels. Well, that's a pawn. Should we test Transport's theory? Or am I taking his words out of context? If I pawn that, I can consider throwing the red dragons. Um, uh, or might consider keeping the red dragons for my pair and be content with just keeping Ricci. Okay, yeah, that's fair too. So transport saying pawn everything is a strategy. I'm kind of curious about this strategy. I, you know I'm always itching to push buttons and see what happens. Mm -hmm. But um, if it's something really stupid, maybe I shouldn't. Like, I see a button. Buttons are fun to push. But if I take that, like, my chances of giving them a tile they win with are pretty high. They did discard a 6, so I could discard a 6, but then after that I'm really short on good discards. <laughs> yeah, I mean, we were saying all simples. If all simples is a strategy, that um, holding 9s would not at all help me get all simples. And like you're mentioning here, I should try... I mean, I've got a 9 there, a 9 here. Like, I'm not getting all simples. I'm not going out this hand, basically. So I just need to play defensively at this point. Which is totally not my style. That's why I'm prevaricating on this. Um, I'm dealer here. Okay, yes. Yeah, so if I win... I then I get to be dealer again. <laughs> um I see. Yeah, lounges be internet folks though. Some internet folks can be weird. Um but I see what you're saying at noob levels. As opposed to like here I'm playing against AIs that have some degree of intelligence. Uh, yeah, if I win, I keep the dealer roll. So winning would be quite nice. I have more incentive to try to win than other players do. So, that said, I don't have Yoku. A oh, Richie would be my Yoku. Okay, but I can't do... I'm trying to remember. For Ricci, you don't have to have, like, yeah. You, it's okay to pawn and other things, and you can still Ricci after having done pawn. I think. Um, oh, winning with quick small hands is a strategy. Okay. That's cool. Yes, I'm looking at this. I'm trying to win every single hand because I'm an idiot. Um, so I'm just going to pawn this. Just It's the questionable strategy. It's the meme. We're, we're going to do it and see in this case why it's perhaps silly. So. All right. There is a six. 
So we could chi and then chuck the nine. I don't see any problem with that. Although, I mean, we've already played some nines. There's no point in this. This would be a wasted turn for me to chi that. There's no reason to chi that. Oh, Richie requires a fully concealed hand. Okay, thanks. Yeah, I did not remember. Now we know. Um, so, okay, one's already been discarded. We'll discard a one. Um, yeah, and then we consider this, because uh, we just don't know what they have. I can't read that. That looks like a five. Um, yeah, so at this point, because I didn't reach E, um, hmm. let's see, that's a three, this is a three, I'm feeling stupid, let's do this. Chi, that's a nine. Again, we don't need that. Um, got a four. No. All right, not my fault. Yeah, but I'm not the one paying this. Sure, I lost the round, but that wasn't my fault. South gets to pay that one. Uh, yeah, so I'm second. That's fine. East round four. Fight! Alright, so... Um, don't have any irrelevant wins. We see uh, one of the dragons is going to be the Yoku. Or no, the bonus whatever the word for bonus is again this is a disconnected tile so do i have other disconnected tiles to check first we got three four six seven nine so seven nine are disconnected one three are likewise disconnected uh but here we got three four five six seven nine one three six so this is the most actually this is the most disconnected of them all i don't know they're all pretty awful <laughs> one three six seven seven nine versus uh, six seven nine uh got lots of ones and nines that's cool I'm just trying to figure out which one or which nine is the best first discard. It's probably almost entirely irrelevant here. Because I'm going to end up discarding the other ones in very short order. Um, math is hard. So, six, seven are useful. This nine doesn't really help the six, seven at all. Here, this 7 might need the 9. These 7s don't need the 9 at all. We're going to check this 9. Um, Drew, this... There's nothing on this tile. <laughs> Alright. Uh, you throw the 9 of character. Yeah. There's nothing on this tile. What happened? No, I'm joking. <laughs> um... So, yeah, the 9... Okay, actually, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 is a weight on 2, 5, 8. Oh! Oh, that's cool. I didn't know... Oh, yeah, you could get 2, 5, or 5, 8. Yeah, that's right. Uh, or, sorry, no, 2, 5, 8, actually. I'm trying to think that through. That's really confusing. Um, seven of character doesn't need the nine. Yeah, okay. Right. Yeah, okay, that's a good point. 
All right, we got a dragon. We got all these tiles. We got a dragon. We got a dragon. Oh, that's the bonus tile, as determined by this, the Dora. All right. Somebody's already discarded a Dora. Um. So. Like, my odds out of 58 tiles of getting the other two are pretty bad. I'm much more likely to get this set of dragons than that set. It is a safe discard, but we're playing for speed here. Need for speed. Um, yeah, so ones and nines and then dragons. All right, so... I contend that this one is disconnected. But the three, it's not like completely disconnected. There's already a three down here. So the three kind of sort of needs this one. It's not, so it's probably better I get rid of one of these. Yeah, we're going to check this first. Because that's already been discarded. Okay, we did draw another three. Somebody else is eventually going to go three, but we don't need our other dragon because we don't have two dragons. Beachy. Okay, now safe tiles matter. No, I don't want to end up paying the player who's in first. Wait, they're not in first. I thought they were in first, but the score here it says 328, 321. I was convinced they the standings said that I was in first, but okay, whatever. Or that I was in second, but something happened. Oh, okay, so ones and nines, they've already discarded a four, and then they called Ricci here. So one is almost certainly safe. Not certainly, but almost. Um, I'm just going to check the one. It's risky. All right, we got a pair of eight. Uh, yeah, so now I've got to play safe. Shit. <laughs> ah, that's no fun. Man, why I gotta play safe moves? That's a three and an eight. Um, yeah, that's super annoying. I don't have a safe play. Wanna circle safe ish? Yeah, three of bamboo. Oh, right, yeah, they've played a three of bamboo here. I need to play a safe play, so we're gonna do three bamboo. And then we could do three bamboo again. Continues to be a safe thing to discard. <laughs> I could she that. Um, obviously, I'm just. How does that even work? Oh, seven, eight. Wait, six, seven, eight. Um, no, I don't need that. I get that it's a safe discard, but no. I am nowhere close. And plus that, I'd not be able to reach you. Well, I can't do reach you if somebody else did it. Um, so... Looking at these, do I have one of these things? Um, definitely chi and discard. Oh, sorry. I just don't know what I'm doing. The one bamboo is the... Well, we just drew a two bamboo now. <laughs> ah, we willed that into our possession. Uh, but no, this is a disaster. Uh, I don't... Hmm. All right, so... I've confused the ever-living daylights out of myself. They've discarded a two and a four. So, but if I want to have any chances of winning the round, I need to keep this straight open. We just have one two here, but then we wouldn't have a valid Yoku. Um, so the one still has to go. Oh. Wait, can multiple players reachy? I made that up. I'm making up all the rules as I go. 
and Abigail's correcting me constantly because I'm getting all the rules wrong. Um, I'm so confused. Wait, so I have all symbols except for this one. So I'm still going to discard the one, even though I just drew a two. Now I drew another one. Um... All right, so now I've got four, five, six, which is somewhat pleasant, but I don't have a safe discard. Um, hmm. This hand up here is sufficiently ambiguous that I don't know what they're doing. Um, maybe it's clear to somebody else what they're doing, I don't think it's clear what they're doing. Um, but yeah, despite having just drawn four, five, six, um, I could take a chance. I could discard either the two or the six here and probably lose the round. Unless somebody else is... I mean, there's a two discarded already. That was four rounds ago. Potentially things have changed. Um, but, uh, yeah, seven of bamboo is safe-ish, two of bamboo is safe. Huh. So because this four rounds ago, oh, I don't understand how two is safe. Four rounds ago it might have been safe. Here, maybe things have changed, but probably not. I see a three and a three have both gone out. There's another three. Okay, so, like, unless they're collecting all the twos, but they couldn't because there's another two. Um, no, they could still have two twos, but that wouldn't make sense with what they've done here. So two's pretty safe. Okay, we got a button. This is Richie? This is Richie. This is the meme. All right. Um, okay, if it was safe back then, it's still safe. I don't understand that logic. Because you can't pick up tiles from older plays in the wall, in the discard. Um, potentially their hand could have changed over the last four-ish turns. Well, no, they have Ricci. Their hand doesn't change. I see. I forgot what turn they did. Oh, that's how you know what turn they did the Ricci. Well, that's clever. Yeah. So you can see here, turn five, they reach. He's turn six, this is safe. Their hand is not changing because they did reachy. All right. YOLO. This is fun. Let's do it. If we lose the round, it's not my fault. The AI made me discard these tiles. Hey, we win. No. Kaboom! Alright. Thanks, Yamachiro. Uh, yep, thanks for stopping by. For those who don't know, Yamachiro does uh, do cooking streams and video game streams and things like that. Uh, so feel free to check out her uh, channel. So, yep. Cool. Uh, yeah, so how did this work? We got, we did Ricci, which gave us the call. I'm sorry. Ah, oh, my head. Ricci gave us a call. All Simples also gave us, would have also sufficed beyond simply Ricci, but so these are both Hans. All runs. Oh, yeah, we did do all runs. How about that? Um... And then a bonus tile being the five. And since... Wait, why is this showing? I thought since we we did Ron, we did Ron, we didn't do um, Sumo. Why, do, why is the Uradora tile showing? I don't get it. Um, all runs is Pinfu. Yeah. 
The infamous Pinfu you mentioned before. Yes. Well said. Um, hang on. Wait a second. Oh, I see. Yeah. You mentioned earlier 258 was the win. And now I see what you mean by 258. Any of 2 or 5 or 8. Any one of those suffices to win. You have this kind of run. That's really cool. I did not realize that, even though you said it in perfect detail, I just didn't understand it. Um, the Orodora is because of Ricci. Nice. Yeah, we'll see how well the passive play works out. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, we'll, we'll get to it. We'll get to it. We'll see. And we're south round one. Why did I say that we're going to play eight rounds? Oh, we just need to make one of these players run out of points, and then that'll end things faster. <laughs> no, it's not happening. Um, so, okay, first, irrelevant wins. Second, ones and nines. And third, oh, sorry, thought I had a broadcast error there for a second. And third, um after irrelevant wins and ones and nines then consider relevant wins and dragons um okay so or disconnected ones and nines is what we said oh my god <laughs> get a pair of nines a pair of nines um not what we wanted to see all right uh, yeah, it's true. At this point, I'm finally three hours into this session. I'm starting to understand the basic rules of the game and needing to start understanding the advanced rules a bit better. <laughs> Try going for Richie when they're all spamming Chi and Pa. <laughs> so yeah, you remember, or you weren't here the first hour. I was spamming the buttons. Buttons are fun to push. Um, turns out that button mashing is not a good strategy. Who'd have guessed? Alright, so let's start with disconnected ones and nines. The most disconnected one or nine would be this one. So away the one goes. Okay, and now we got... The east wind. This is a south round, and east wind is useless um, to me. Potentially, it could have been useful to the east player, but the east player discarded the east wind. So that tells you just how useful an east wind is. That's, I mean, that's so weird. I don't get that. I, oh, I see. An east wind had already been discarded. So that might have motivated this discard. Okay, we could chi this, but then we can't get Richie. So there's absolutely no reason to chi that. Uh, we don't need it. Spamming buttons is fun. Um, okay. So that's not just... Okay, what the hell? <laughs> All simples is not going to happen. I'm sorry. So what... What's the backup plan? If I can't get that as a valid hand, then I have to know the Yoku. Well, damn. That's a bit of a problem. So, the next most disconnected one or nine would be this nine. So, away it goes. Pawn. Well, that's... Oh, we don't have a valid Yoku. We don't need that. There's going to be another one of that that comes around at some point. So that would be dumb to take. Fuck. <laughs> I think I'm just going to discard my nine bamboo next. Um, if, yeah, no, we need Richie. So... At this point, nine. Well, 
This is even more useless. No, disconnected ones and nines first. These are disconnected. Away it goes. I'm done with that one. Didn't draw an eight. Don't need the nine. This is a west wind. It is useful. We're going to keep it. What the is this number? Yeah, if we're going to play online games, I have to know what the numbers are. <laughs> That's a seven. Um, Chi, I don't even know why this is an option. Seven, eight, nine is the option, but I've already got a seven. Like, I very clearly don't need that. Unless there's some really weird, super special thing going on here, but no. Um, one, two, four. Four is pretty cool. Uh, we mentioned discarding disconnected ones and nines. Um, hang on. So, wasn't there at least one nine that already went out here? I'm trying to make a case for discarding one of these pair of nines. But no, this is useless. This is completely useless. The nines are redundant. I don't need two nines. One nine is good enough. But if I got a third nine, maybe we're talking. So I think this is the... It's either going to be the dragon, or for safety, we discard this first and then the dragon. Um, oh, the, the... Right, we need a pair. There's the pair. Oh. Just kidding. Okay. Uh, the nine of bamboo were my pair. Oh. Yeah. I'm an idiot. That's why. Question answered. <sighs> right. I keep focusing on needing three of a kind or needing a, a run. I keep focusing on that. But you actually need a pair also, in addition to all the other things you need. A pair is necessary. Okay. Well, now I do have a pair still. Um, but, yeah, that was very poorly thought out. That pair would have been quite useful to keep around. Um, my odds of getting... Has somebody discarded a West Wind yet? West Winds have not been discarded. I could still hold on to it. Terrify the other players. Um, you can't call to complete the pair unless it's Ron. Oh wow, you could call to complete a, Ron, a pair in Ron? Did not know that. That's really funny. Uh, let's do that. Okay, so, uh, yeah, just have to summon the correct tiles by sheer force of will. So, uh, this is a really special hand. <laughs> I've heard about such a thing as a half blush um, on the American Ricci. We've got a lot of character tiles. Um, we got a lot of a lot of character tiles. All right. Oh, yeah. All right. That's entirely fair. Have a good night. Why did I pick up the wind tile anyway? I don't know. Um, I mean, at this point, the odds of getting another wind tile are not good. Oh, my odds of getting all simples are also extremely not good here. Um, so yeah, I will need the winds as my Yoku unless I get some other Yoku, but that's probably not happening. Yeah, I discarded my pair, and consequently I'm screwed. Um, so... Have people been discarding characters? We saw a seven go out. I could have used the seven. Not really, but um, 
We've got five, seven, eight, nine, nine. We're gonna have another eight. And if we had another seven, we'd have seven, seven, eight, eight, nine, nine, which would be cute. Um, in terms of safety, we see a well. We don't know anything about safety here. Honor tiles are bad for noobs, since you can't make a straight or a flush. Ah, okay. Um. Yeah, at this point. It doesn't heavily matter what I do because I gave away my two best tiles and don't have much chance of recovery. Um, so. Let's just play. <laughs> uh, that's one of those. Um. I don't need that. Hey, look, there's my wind tile. Now we're in business. Kind of, sort of, almost. Not really. Uh, the one and the two might have to go next. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, wait, nine, nine, eight, eight, seven. Five, four, two, one, and a pair of wins. Um, okay, this is useless. Uh, <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, the one goes. Shit. Shit! Wait, this is an eight character tile. It's telling me I could pawn it for three eights. Um, that looks like a terrible idea for me to take, because then it would be my turn. And I would have to discard something and not die. Um, so better would be not doing that. Um, hmm, now we have a pair of eights as well as two, oh, the two's disconnected. Um, uh, do I have odds of getting it? Hang on. We don't want to do anything absolutely retarded that will cost me the round, especially not to this guy. So I want to pick among stuff that, well, I don't have a lot of options here. Um, but yeah, I don't want to lose the round, so we're just going to play defensive here. Um, Well, we lost the round anyway. Hacks! Hacks! Cheater. <laughs> Alright. Whatever. Sometimes you draw the right tiles and play it well. Sometimes I don't play well, despite having drawn good tiles. Alright. So, south round one. Oh, they get to deal again. We're still in round one of south. Uh, so. Alright, do we have any irrelevant winds? We got a north wind, which is useless. We've also got an east wind. Um, so, screw east. Alright, then the north wind is useless. We could chi the one. Or, we could not. Um, Alright, then we got a pair of... This game likes to give me ones. Sony ones. Disconnected ones and nines. Well, that's a pair. We don't chuck that. Um, Yeah, I mean, I know this is connected, but I want to discard it anyway. Because I'm an idiot. Um, 
yeah, whatever. I'm entitled to be an idiot sometimes. Um, this is nowhere. Yeah, you know, I still want to keep the pair, despite not being able to do all simple with the pair. It's fine. We don't need. Ultimately, we might get a different pair and decide that's not going to be our pair. But right now, we don't know that. Um, the six is disconnected, so let's chuck it. Got a three. Three is kind of close to one. Uh, two, three, three, three. Two, I mean, arguably, I'm probably not getting a slew of fours. But if I did get a lot of threes, and if I did get another three, and if I got a four, I could make something happen there. It's not happening, but yeah, no, there's the power of if. All right, so seven. Oh, that's cool. So <sighs> my head hurts. <laughs> that's all right. Um, not what I wanted to do. Five bamboo. Well, if I keep discarding bamboo, I'm not. This is not going to be a happy hand. Um. So if I'm aiming to do all simple, uh, I'm the reason I'm liking this is because it's glowing. But glowing just means it's a bonus tile. It doesn't have any special power or utility here. There we go. So we have a different pair. Since we have a different pair, I don't need this pair, but... Um, yeah, we could go for all simple if I could chuck these ones. Uh, oh gosh. Well... Alright, so we got... This is the south wind. Which is useless for me. Um, that's... Uh, I think it's dangerous for me to hold on to this. So let's play it immediately. I don't really know. The south... Oh, I'm sorry. The south wind's useful for everybody. It's a dangerous thing to discard late in the game. Unless a lot of them have already been discarded. But one person already discarded a south wind, so we're all going to play this gambit of... Yeah. I should do the Mahjong Soul tutorial. Yeah, that would be a smart thing to do to play the game well. You're not wrong. I would improve at the game. No. Oh, I lost. Vampire. Honitsu. Dora. Hanemon. It's playing. Oh my gosh. All right. Well, North player wins. At least North player is not the dealer. Oh, hey, cool. East had to pay out to north. That increases my lead. I'll take it. Sure. Nice. Probably doesn't do anything to increase my rating or ranking at the end. Pawn. Pawn turn one. Hey. There we go. Now we're talking. <laughs> uh, you know, that's the meme. We're gonna pawn. There we go. Turn one pawn. Got the south wind. Probably a ridiculously stupid move, but we did it. Um, so, that was a thing. Alright. Um, yeah, we wouldn't get content plays if I knew what I was doing. Hey, look! I got a pawn and a chi. Alright, so... I mean, this is ridiculous what I'm doing, but sure. Useless wind at this point can go. Um, yeah, this... Uh, I've read, oh, that's a disconnected nine, so that can go. Pump! Um, okay, having disc 
discarded all the disconnected ones and disconnected nines. The next thing would be um, useful winds and dragons. So yeah, for speed, we're just gonna max the speed out on this. It's not a useful win to me. Could pawn the two. Sure, that seems fun. Huh. Boom. All right. Uh, that's a one. We can't do that. That's a five. Um, let's see. If somebody discarded, let's chuck the two bamboo. Uh, that's another wind I have no use for. Uh, that's a six. Six is kind of cool. Uh, now if I look at the board just for even one instant, this is my seven... Is the seven useless? Which do I need less? Yeah, we're going to check the seven. Um... Two, three, five, six. All right. Oh my gosh. Yeah, now let's hit the button here. Wait. That didn't do what I thought. <laughs> okay. I had a button last turn. It was a different button. I still have no idea what that button was for. But now here we are. Uh, this one's already discarded, so let's discard the other one. Um, three, four, five, six. Oh, hang on. Yeah. That's nice that gives you clues. Well, wrong game. Bummer. Yeah, should have hit whatever the purple button was earlier. That's fine. South, round two. Um, Alright, so first, discard useless wins. Oh wow, a nine? No, we're not doing that. So then disconnected ones and nines. We have a disconnected one, so let's chuck it. Or discard it. Um, we have a disconnected nine, so let's discard it. And we have a connected one. So for speed, let's discard this instead. Chi. Oh wow. I'm surprised that's a chi, but it is. Um, two... okay. I'm not wild about this. Um, I don't like my one. No, I'm sorry, they've got one, two, three. And a four, so I don't need the one. Now I've got two, three, four. It's even better than that. And then here's an eight. Um, I don't need the eight. Oh my goodness, I drew another one. This game hates me. <laughs> it's rigged! Alright, yeah, we're still playing Mahjong. Yep. We're still doing the Maj. Alright, so... Let's see. I'm just learning something new today. And I think, it, thanks to Abigail, I've learned quite a bit. Um, so, yeah. Let's discard that. Hmm. Hmm. What are my odds?
odds on getting a three. <coughs> um, better than my odds on not getting it, I guess, or whatever. Um, yeah, let's check this. That's an eight. That's the second eight, isn't it? Do I need it? No. Um. Beachy. Mm hmm. Long. Well, I deserved that. I wasn't looking. Ippatsu, Sanshiki, Dora, Haneman. Hey, look! I get to pay out a lot because I was careless. Um. Uh. Yeah. Yeah, these are Japanese rules, obviously. Hey, look! I lost like half my points, and I went from first to fourth place. Maybe I should care about the score. Maybe. Or maybe next time I should play, like, instead of a full eight, I should just do four east wins and that'd be enough. Um, Alright, I'm in south position. Got a south and a south. Uh, got a north. North's no good. Uh, got a one. Away the one goes. Hey, we could pawn that. Let's... I don't need to. Uh, five. Wait. So, I got rid of disconnected ones and nines. No, this is still a disconnected one. Away it goes. That's a nine. It's connected to the eight. So, a faster thing would be to discard this. Pump. Really? Okay, could she the three, but there's no reason. Another nine gives me a pair of nines. Um, so... This would give me four, five, six, seven, nine, nine, or four, five, four, five, six, eight, nine, nine, two, three, four, eight, uh, five, eight. Yeah, five, eight is not great. Let's dispose of the eight. Here's a nine. Just oh my goodness. Um, interesting. Okay, I don't know what this, how this happened, but here, um, I've got a button. We're gonna push the button, and the game's gonna figure out the rest of this for me. So, well, damn, I tried. I tried. Side so pay out again. Still in fourth place. Dealer moves again. Yeah, we tried though. South round three. Uh, turns out there is some strategy to this game. Who knew? Um, one three nine. Yeah. So nine goes. Could she the one, which would be silly. Um. Oh my goodness, so many ones. Here goes a one. Yeah, I keep focusing on Pinfu way too much. No, I'm not going to do that. Pinfu was cool the one time I did it. Um, but it's not relevant anymore. Uh, well, that's kind of cool. Yeah, it'd be nice to pin through every game if you could, like, win every single time, but this game's not that simple. Uh, disconnect. Well, that's a pair. Wait. Man, when am I going to get to do seven pairs? Um, 
Your neighbor said her father used to be able to tell, feel the surface of the piece and tell what the tile was. Ah, wow. That's powerful. That's some dark magic there. Um. <laughs> yeah. Well, I guess if they're engraved, that helps. But otherwise, uh, that's still pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, you said you could feel the underside of the tile and know what the other face is. Yeah, that's that indicates you've played with the set quite a bit. Um, all right, this is not perfect. Um, wait, so this, yeah, oh my gosh, I don't know what to do. I'm I have many poor options here. Um, yeah, let's... This 9 is not helping. Could pawn that, but there... Oh, that's the last one of those. Um, no, we don't need this. Unless... Yeah, I would have to still look at... So, I think built into the game, how to play, about Mahjong, discarding mechanics, the buttons, the other buttons, about tiles. These answer many of the questions I keep bringing up over and over, but I could have just read this rather than trying to make it up. Every winning hand requires a pair. Concealed triplet. Opponent on the left, opponent on the right, uh, opposite, one tile short, tenpai, chi, pawn, con, sumo, ron, um, rule, standard rules, exposed all, okay, standard rules for Ah, additional hand. Don't know what that means. Exposed all simples optional. Uh, multiplayer rules. Drawn game conditions. Alternate rules. All right, so these are all rules that could be, that either are rules or could be things to consider. Yaku. This is where we're starting. Simple Yaku. Richi. You only need Tenpai. Um, and have not claimed other people's tiles. First turn win. If you declare ready and then immediately within the turn. What? Oh, it adds a Han. But you'd have to have declared ready. Um with Ricci. Concealed self draw sumo, obviously. All runs is Pinfu. All runs, all simples. Okay, sorry, I keep getting these confused. So all runs could include ones and nines. All simples cannot include ones and nines. And then there's other rules. Um, if they have an open triplet and then draw the fourth, they can add the drawn fourth to make a quad. And at that time, another player can win on the tile by robbing the tile as long as... Oh, that's funny. Yeah. Then there's special stuff. But okay. So, two rules in question. All runs versus all simples. Obviously, a pair... Is not going to qualify for all simples. Wait. Unless. Maybe that's my point of confusion. So. All simples. Only numbered tiles from 2 through 8 are used eliminating terminals or honors. If the hand's open, it's killed, called Koitan. Kutan. I don't know. 
which means Tanyo mean they eating discards. If there are varieties of rules, this can be closed only. So, yeah, if you have all simples, does that mean that the pair also cannot be, have to be between 2 and 8? Because that's the last time why I just did that crazy discard. Um, it's because I was trying to get all simples and confusing that with all runs, I think. And maybe I had a chance at all runs, but I had a pair, and the pair were not between 1 and 9. So I'll have to look at tutorials sometime and not be so frustrated about this. Um, anyway, we could pawn this, which seems silly. Um, it brings me no closer to winning. Yeah, getting... I mean, let's go back through how to play. Yaku 1 we already looked at. Complete winning hands. Wait, we didn't get through all of this, did we? Robbing a quad, on sea, king's tile, double run, two identical sequences. That's cool. Um, value tiles. Vampire, Wind of the Round, One's Own Wind, Three Dragons. Three Dragons qualifies as Vampire. Um, any triples or quads of dragons, the player's wind, and the prevailing wind. Oh, wow. So, yeah, I didn't know that. That's kind of cool. But three dragons. So that's not... I'm confused about Fompai here. Could that mean three identical dragons or three different dragons? I assume three identical dragons does it. Um, I could look this up. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe not. Save me, Google. Uh, so... To do Yukuhai, Yakuhai, or Fanpai. Uh, it's a group of one Han scored for completing a group of honor tiles, tile patterns. All right, examples. Triplet of green dragons satisfies Yaku, regardless of seating and win round. All right, so this would be a Valid Yaku. Um, wait. Okay, so this is still under the simple category. Nice. Um, yeah, so Triple Dragon uh, does qualify as a Yaku. And since that's the final one of this dragon, let's pawn it. So this is a valid winning hand now that I have dragons. Unless those aren't dragons, but forget that. Um, so I have a valid hand at this point. So let's see. Uh, for those this far into the video and have forgotten what we've been up to, this is Japanese Mahjong. This is not um, Chinese Mahjong. So, uh, probably the eight, unless somebody's already discarded a three. I don't see a three discard here. I do see a four. Wait, six and eight are equidistant as three and five. Um, somebody's discarded one four already, so... That might bias me toward discarding the 3 rather than the 8, although the 3 is more toward the center than an 8 is. Um, I also got 1, 2, 3, 5, 8 over here. What the hell am I going to do with this 8? It looks cool, but it's not useful. Yeah, so let's discard that 8. Um, 
West wind is not useful at all. Another west wind's not useful. Chi. Chi would draw two that I already have. Pardon me. Um drew a nine. That is a connected eight nine sequence. Um so we could aim for five, six, seven, eight, nine. Um, so yeah, let's discard the three, since I have a Yaku. Okay, this is the North Wind, useful. Oh, that's interesting, I just realized that the North Wind doesn't look entirely dissimilar from a dragon. Um, hmm. I remember... Yeah, in Shogi, a dragon flies like the wind. So that's interesting. This is a 7. That's a 5. I don't have a use for a 7. Also, maybe I shouldn't be super invested because I'm already quite not doing super well this uh, since I lost half my points uh, to north. So maybe I shouldn't get too emotionally invested in this. It is fun to imagine the ways this can go, but also emotional investment might be a bit much. All right, the nine is unlikely to be useful. Well, shit. Um, yeah, again, let's not get too invested. That's a four. That is cool. Uh, please, since this happened, let there have been a 5 already discarded. Because 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 seems like a thing. Uh, screw it? Yeah, I survive. No. Shit. Buddy, I was going to win the round. But North had to ruin it for me. Way to go, North. Alright, so... South round four. Alright. Hey, I've got the North Wind. That's actually useful here. Useless ones and nines. Well, that's a disconnected nine. And somebody already discarded one of those. Um, disconnected ones and nines include this. Okay, well now we drew the two that could have gone next to the one, but it's too late. It's okay. Do I have any other disconnected ones? In the That's connected to that. So, nope. Uh, we don't have any disconnected ones and nines, so let's discard this instead. Uh, crud. So, six, eight. We don't need the two then. We've already discarded a one. Got another one. Um, actually, that was a one of bamboo. This is a one of pins or circles. Uh, that's cool. So five, five, six, six, eight, nine, six, eight, three, four, seven, seven, seven. Hmm, what's my lucky play here? What's my lucky play? Again, Pinfu seems like a fun thing to aim for. Uh, wait. All simples versus all runs. All runs can include a 9. But now I've got something that's not a run. So, this is not disconnected. Let's discard this for maximum aggression. Three, four, five, seven, seven, seven. Wow. Holy crap. This is an interesting hand. So for speed, I could consider sacrificing the north wind. Let's do it. Let's do it. 
Pete. Take me home. Pong. Yeah, this is the best part. You don't even have to think about it. You just push the button and it just automates the rest. Beach. Woo! Sumo. Sumo. Whoa. Okay, so we did the Richie, which made us eligible to win. We had all simples, which is another win condition. So both of these would have qualified me to win this. Also, I get bonus, uh, I get a bonus because I did this entirely on my own accord and did not take any tiles from anyone else. Also, apparently, yeah, I got the one bonus tile. Didn't hit the Dora, didn't hit the Rotodora. Don't really pay any attention to those. Maybe I should. But where's the fun in that? Still, oh, I was gonna say I'm still in fourth place, but no. Uh, rankings updated there. And that concludes the game. Uh, we all started with 25,000 points. I've concluded this game with 28,000 points for a spread of three. Woo! Hooray. All right. Was that fun? I hope you enjoyed that. Just as a reminder, this is Mahjong Nagomi, copyright 2020 Zoo Corporation. Um, and let me check one last time under, nope, somewhere under here. Uh, there's more information about you can find how you get this game on Steam. Yeah, there's the credit. I was looking for the credit button, so fonts here, help text, share alike, license, etc. But yeah, you can get this game really cheaply on Steam. Um, perhaps other places too, I don't know. But yeah, hope you enjoyed this. Thanks for watching.